Alrighty, I do believe we are live. Greetings, adventurers. Welcome to another episode of Tower Place Modded, Mac M Modded Minecraft Pack of Heresy Version 2. I'm sorry, I tried talking. My brain decided to clump everything together as quickly and horribly as it could. <sighs> Anyways. When we last left off, I had remade the pack and started the new world. We are currently doing a Seven Curses run Starting in the Twilight, which I've never done before. I've done Seven Curses runs basically every time I ever play with Enigmatic Legacy. Uh, purely because it's just a more interesting thing. Sometimes it's a pain in the ass. <clears throat> Dying over 3,000 blocks away in the Twilight. Um, but, you know, whatever. Um, that's fine. It's fine. I can work with it. I am not at all salty. Uh, and I am not at all playing it purely so I can get the twist of the infinitum. And, you know, Keystone of... Not Keystone of Oblivion. Heart of the Cosmos. And, you know, the ultimate amulet. And all, all the bullshit that, you know, the curse-bearing run actually gives you. Because half the fucking mod is locked behind the Ring of Seven Curses in this version. So, yeah. That's enough enigmatic legacy complaining. Complaining, I'm just talking about the mod. Uh, the game is currently booting up right now, so if you guys see any stuttering, hear any stuttering, anything like that, that's why. I'm going to go ahead and undeafen in VC. By the way, if you join the Patreon Discord, Buck a Month gets you in. Uh, you can join random uh, VC streams like this. You also get access to all the various... Uh, Art that I post, because I keep forgetting to post to the Patreon. It's just basically in the art channel of the Discord. I'm too lazy to cross-post it. Um, shill over. Uh, commands and shit like that. You can probably just run and find out on Twitch and whatnot. Alrighty. So that's there. I'm going to go ahead and undeafen now. And let's get this shit show on the road. You guys are up in the upper right corner. Why is there a chest here? What happened? What 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 was this chest from? Oh, did I log out inside of a hollow hill? Or is that just when I took the screenshot? Because if I logged out inside of a hollow hill, I'm going to punch past Tired in the fucking face. Never mind. I just remembered how much iron and copper I got. So even if I am in there, doesn't matter. I'm rich. I wonder if Madeline is an actual metal. So I was thinking, right? I was thinking about uh, the iron that I got in making a set of plate armor from Tinkers. And I was like, okay, I can probably do that. I mean, I have a, um, <clears throat> a decently sized forge. Hold on, give the game a second in order to wake up. I swear I normally don't get 12 FPS and whatnot. Uh, I'm praying to God this does not become a regularity. Then again, I am in the twilight, so, you know, I kind of asked for it. Yeah, so... Hello! Apocalyptic message. I, I'm so sorry, I'm bad with names. Uh, I... Brain is dying. Hold on. Oh. If you are new, welcome. If you are not, welcome back. I am sorry. I'm so sorry. Uh, you got affiliate? Nice. Okay, so it's been a while. <laughs> you know, I got that a bit ago. Um, 
brain is dying. Hold on one second. Ah. I literally just got back from driving lessons, so like my brain is still fried from going on the freeway for the first time in my life. Uh, which, by the way, um, terrifying to get on, perfectly fine once you're there, terrifying to get off. It, at least, final verdict right now. <laughs> yeah. Alright, so I need more gravel. Fuck. Well, I can probably get that. Also, I don't need to worry about being loud. Thank God, because I'm probably going to get loud. I think I'm already loud, I don't know. Uh, I think there's gravel over here. I remember mentioning it last stream. But one amazing thing about doing runs in the twilight is you don't need to worry about anything on the surface at all. You don't need to worry about any hostile creatures on the surface because they just straight up do not spawn. Now, I don't know if that's a bug or an intended feature. Either way, I like it. All right, so I can my soul stone with that. Okay. Also, occasionally my vein mine just decides no. So... That's why I was happy that actually worked. Alright, so... Gravel, 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 where is it? Twilight is wonky. It, yeah. It's a it's a fun mod, it's just like... It's a fun mod. <laughs> it's sometimes a little finicky, but... You know, a mod of its size, magnitude, and... Renown, you know, you'd kind of expect that. I did not mean to press my caps lock. I don't know what I had that bound to. I'm afraid that I just fucked something up. Alright, so that's a fair amount of gravel, a fair amount of uh, flint as well, but I don't know if I'm going to need more, which is the problem with making fucking Tinker's Forges, because you have to do math. And now you need four gravel per brick, right? So four gravel, sand, and clay per brick. Uh, not, not minding that. It should go around, right? Yeah, that went around. Uh... Though, I think you could make it in bulk if you use clay blocks, question mark? Don't quote me on that. I might be wrong. I might be remembering a wrong version of the mod. I might have removed that or made it different. I don't know. Uh, okay, I got the gravel and the clay there. Alright, that was barely any clay, uh, gravel there. Keep thinking that I'm saying flint when I'm actually saying the right thing. But I keep thinking I'm saying the wrong thing. If you, it's like the opposite of thinking you're saying the right thing, but you're actually saying something completely fucking wrong. It's like math, yes. <sighs> math is not fun. Uh, buh, brain death. So one thing about starting in the twilight is that I don't have much armor. All I have is the stuff that I've found and the stuff that I've managed to like cobble together. Which means that I can't go after the bosses. And I'm not leaving here until I kill all the bosses. So I need to fucking shape up or ship out. Like Wait, and ship out or bah bah. You know, I've heard that saying so much from my dad that I kinda just forgot it. Like just stopped caring about it. <laughs> Alrighty. So this is the domain. So far it's meh, but everything starts small. Uh, that goes, nope, that is not go inside of the ore's chest. Tired, what the fuck? Uh, this is the ore's chest, and I do not put soul stone inside of the fucking, uh, Natural materials chest. <sighs> All right. All right. That 
should be enough. Yeah, that should be plenty. Um, the problem now becomes the clay. Not the clay, the uh, coal. Because I don't know if I have enough. Iron helmet. Okay. Shit. God damn it. This exact same spot on the other arm was being annoying yesterday. Fuck. Alright. Um. Well, was, you know, it was the axe that had all that fancy stuff on it. Alright. I need to make lava. Uh, lava crystal requires obsidian, which means you need to find lava already. This requires lava. That, I don't even know if I can make. This requires me to go kill blazes. Uh... Mix cobblestone with a blaze burner, which, you know, requires actual lava. Um, Um, yeah, math, yes, I thought I saw movement in the corner of my eye and I freaked out a little. All right, uh, all right, boom, 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 God damn it, I need more coal. Um, do I have, yeah, I have enough glass for this. All right. I think I'm going to go ahead and make a couple pieces of just seared windows. Uh, burp, whatever. Want is seared glass. Okay. Uh, one, we're going to go ahead and get two pieces of that. Oh, you piece of shit. I think I'm gonna go ahead and sh do those then. right now. I don't know why I did that instead of just Doing it by hand. Also, I realized I fucked up because I could have used that to make more seared glass. And me.
close enough. Probably put those away for now. Alright, uh, glass. Need to make one, two, three, four. Oh, well, four. One, two, three, four. That's a nice window. Okay, I don't know what happened there. Might have just been an encoding overload, but apparently it disconnected. Uh, sorry about that. Um... To grab that and push. That there, that there. Well, the stream didn't die, right? Uh. My channel. Pack of heresy, come on. Is my, is my internet just fucked? Hold on. Let me check. Uh, can you guys even hear me right now? Okay, Wi-Fi. Wi-Fi looks like it's still fine. So, not seeing shit. Wait, hold on. Did I have it? No, I have it on the right window. What the? Oh, okay. Alright, alright. I don't know what's going on right now. Uh... There we go. Right, stream manager. All right. Shh. All right. You guys, please, for the love of God, tell me if anything else goes wrong. Right. Do I have buckets? I do. Alrighty, um, I'm going to want, might want another seared fuel gauge if I can make one. I cannot! Alrighty, I need a tank. Unfortunately, blood magic removed its tank system. Fortunately, Evilcraft has one. Alright, so I need glass, dark gems, and iron. I have dark gems and iron. I just need the glass. Ugh. Cold chills. Fucking hell. I hate them. I hate them so much. I need to in 27, 36, 45. Yeah, I, I hate cold chills so much. Alright, so I don't want the small one. I want the big one. It can hold... Can it hold lava? Seeing lava, yeah. I used to use it for blazing blood, and I still probably will, but yeah. Um. Alright. I just need to make more glass, which I will in a brief moment. Yes. This, luckily, I, well, hopefully, I'll be able to fix my pickaxe. Finally. So right now it's a piece of shit. Right. That's a fairly large system. Boop, boop. Yeah, too cold. I know that, that's why I need to get lava. So... Lava. I can make a lava room, which requires lava. Find in nether fortresses, bastions, and your ruined portals. None of which I can find in the twilight, by the way. Um, 
I'm going to make an investment. Really wish my game wouldn't lag like that. What are my frames at? 29. Okay. I keep thinking I'm seeing movement out the corner of my eye and it's driving me insane. Like, I genuinely think I'm hallucinating and shit. I forgot I don't have a proper map because the map in here is broken. Yay. Uh, I forgot to make the tank because I need lava. Mm hmm. Just need two of those, two of those. Hundred and forty four. The ultimate dark tank. Meh. Okay, I went there, not there. Uh, don't need that anymore. Don't think I can melt it, can I? Well, let's chuck it up there. So, goal. Find lava. <sighs> Which is a lot harder than it sounds. The only place that I can think of finding lava is the fire swamp. But unfortunately, I can't go in there yet because I haven't killed the hydra. Because I haven't killed the minor shroom. Because I haven't killed the twilich. And I haven't killed the twilich because I'm a weak-ass motherfucker and that guy kills me in full netherite. So, you know. Uh, skill issue. Alright, uh, only other place I can think of is the Autumn Forest, and the Autumn Forest is... I can make a lodestone. I need to make a lodestone. Hopefully something changed. Nope, nothing changed the fucking recipe for this. Get them in Bastion Bridges. Make them from sigils of socketing. God damn it. I was going to make waystone, but I don't have any enderpearls. And I don't think I have any... Where is... Well, it's still you piece of shit. Alright, I need my axe. This one actually goes fast. Fucker, get over here. Piece of shit. I know you have a fucking... I know you have a relic. I need to kill you. Got it. Regen. Oh, that's actually really good. Alright. Alright. So, the autumn forest, I believe, is this way? I might be completely wrong. Like the idiot I am. Very much often. But... I also might not be wrong. And I might actually be a genius who's going to conquer the world. <sighs> Where's... Is... Lava? Lava? No, just a shitload of mushrooms in a fucking fire firefly jar. Alright. Uh, and nothing down here, okay. Today's stream is going to be probably more the same as yesterday's. Just Twilight adventuring, trying to build up to actually kill the Twilight. By the way, I have all the bosses near my house. I don't need to go adventuring very far in order to find them. Because I have the Ice Queen over there, the Alpha Yeti over there, the Twilight as a neighbor, the Hydra as a neighbor that I already killed, the Fire Swamp to my south, I believe it's south, um, which means the Minor Shroom and the Hydra are there. Uh, the Phantom Knights are somewhere, if I just follow this river, I'll find them. I remember seeing that. Um, which means that the Orgast is somewhere nearby as well. So, like, I got really fucking lucky with my portal placement. 
Yeah, so yeah. Uh, lava? Question mark? No. No lava. Should probably grab more of those maloom trees, actually, because they're really good for fuel. Hopefully I can get it without my axe breaking. I just need to find a pit of lava somewhere. Grab a little bit of that, and we're good to go. There's a tiny hollow hill over here that I might actually investigate, but well, that's only a mite. Because it might end up being a lot bigger than I am mentally prepared to handle. Lava? No, lamps. Uh, lava... Nope, not even a decently sized ravine. What the fuck? There's a normal fucking gash. Ow. Normal sized ass gash in the ground, and that's it. Okay. That's kind of shit. Oh, that's a skeleton. Alright. Normal ass gash in the ground. Where'd that skeleton go? Hopefully it's gone. They're never gone. Oh, it probably fell. Well, I'm not making the same mistake. Getting out of a hole that I fell in. I'm not making the same mistake again. I almost just did. We're not going to talk about any of that. Alright, uh, I wonder if I check the planes over here if I'll find something. I also have to be careful around the lava because if I get lit on fire, I burn until I die. <sighs> Seven curses are just kind of like that. Um, oh yeah, no, uh, Final Forest is also nearby, so if I really do want to kill the final kobold, then I can. I always just try to hit this thing with a torch. Where is all the lava? Please, game. Please don't do this to me. There's fire? That's not fire, that's a mushroom! The entire building is filled with wolves. No. I keep thinking I see movement out the corner of my eye. And I'm probably losing it, but... I know that I've gone only one direction from my house. So, if I need to get home, I just travel in the opposite direction. But it's simple enough, right? Like, that, that that's pretty logical. Is that lava? I'm praying to God that it is. Otherwise I'm going off track for nothing. It's not. It's a fucking tree. So of course the trees glow as much as lava because of these goddamn fireflies. <sighs> Alright, well, let me go ahead and get a better vantage of where I am. That lava? Oh, that might be actually... If so, then y'all bet your ass and I am a very happy camper. Could also just be an orange mushroom with like a glowing thing next to it. But maybe it isn't and I'm holding out hope. Where was it? Was it up ahead, right? Or did I just pass it and not realize? Well, I didn't see any lava, so I did see a bright point though. Fuck. Does lava just straight up not spawn on the surface of the twilight? Or am I just exceptionally unlucky? 
Oh, look, my mushroom right there. Could have sworn it did, but again, that might have just been a previous version of the mod. I'm going to get lost again, aren't I? I'm going to get so fucking lost. It's not even going to be funny for me. It might be funny for you guys, but you guys laugh at my pain. I also don't think ruined portals can spawn in the twilight, so in that regard, I am also screwed. Can't even hope to loot one. No villages spawn in the twilight, so I can't get it from a blacksmith. Uh, uh, it is going to be real funny. Ah, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Alright, so, Final Forest. I am going in the right direction, because it's not the Final Forest, and no, it's just Final Plateau. Because, like, the, the brambles, I think, is technically the forest. Uh, oh, still, point past that. Shh. Past the big hollow hill that I once went in, and I think I died in. Um, yeah, no, I think I entered near that tree. Um, seriously though, uh, does lava spawn on the surface of the fucking twilight forest? Please, I need to know so I don't drive myself crazy running in circles for hours again. I did that yesterday and my hand actually cramped up from how much I ran. It, it wasn't, it was not good. I had to take a breather for a bit. Uh... Hey, uh, transformation powder, valence gems, iron bucket, shovel. Put the sticks, actually, gonna keep a string. I'm uh, gonna keep the spider eye just in case I need it for a recipe. Whoop. Uh, nothing down there. That's a dog. But it's hunting the deer, so it doesn't care about me. Uh, is this where my domain is? Is this the same Naga? So like around this corner, not this, uh, the next corner, I'm going to see my house. Am I lost again? Please don't tell me I'm lost. 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 Fuck! Oh, God fucking damn it. Not again. Not again. Oh, you piece of shit. Uh... Wait, hold on. Is this it? No, it's not. God damn it. Lava? No, torch berries. You'll probably have the trouble until you find a fire swamp biome. I can't go in the biome. I can't go in the fire swamp. I need to kill the mushroom. Or the minus room. Which means I need to kill the twilight. And I can't kill the twilight. Ah, <sighs> fuck's sakes. Not again. How many forests do you guys remember me wandering through? Yeah, head over to the side near the, uh... Okay. Just bear the fire damage. I can't. If I get lit on fire, I burn forever. And the fire swamp is deep within the normal swamp, which, uh, you have to bear mosquitoes to get through, and fuck mosquitoes. I hate them. I hate them so much with a burning passion. You do not understand how much I hate mosquitoes. Both in real life and in game. They are the worst thing ever evolve, and I hate them so much. Please don't tell me I'm lost, for the love of God. <sighs> you, I, I would think that my house would be right here, but it's not. And it's raining. 
Lovely. Um, wait, is it here? Oh, it's here. Oh, thank light. Okay. I'm actually home. Yeah, mosquitoes suck. And the reason why I bring up the, uh, the Twilich as the reason to enter the Fire Swamp is because the Phantom Knights are technically optional, uh, I believe. Though they might not be. No, 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 they're not. They're not. They're not. Because you have to kill them in order to get into the, like, the, uh, the main part of the Dark Forest in order to get to the Urgast. Or, if you're like me, you can actually skip them by grappling over the entirety of the Dark Forest and just walking on the rooftop. So, yeah, technically they're skippable, but they are not meant to be skippable. <sighs> and this run ends whenever I kill everything that the forest has to offer. Including the optional bosses. So, yeah. No skip for me, unfortunately. Well, if I can blink properly, please. Alright. Don't need all these bricks anymore. Just pop them in here. Uh, don't have any ore. Why am I so cold? I do also have ore. Why am I feeling like I'm fucking freezing? What the hell? Sorry, it's just like my entire body is just like really cold right now. What the fuck? I am actually going to go touch the thermostat and fix it. And pray to God I don't have to deal with any teleporting bullshit. I will be right back.
All right, I'm back. Sorry about that. I was just... I actually forgot what I was doing. Um... Like, completely, entirely forgot what I was doing. Um... Alright, what were y'all doing while I was gone? Hopefully not causing any trouble, huh? Hey, back him. Shot. That's on the tier of the fucking warning identity theft detected bit, and even I admit that one's stale as fuck. But no, it's not it's not not just the same tier, it's literally the exact same joke. It's literally just the same joke, just phrased differently. Oh, you're shitting me. Did it take that bow? Oh, for fuck's sakes, really? Really, dudes? Oh, there's a stalker. I saw the two wolves that I instantly knew. Really? Bedrock already? Shit, if I'm gonna find lava, I'm gonna find it here. Yeah, no, that witch hunter scared the shit out of me. Hold on. Well, that's not a witch hunter, that's a fucking wild and stalker. Uh, no, I don't have a lurk command set up, I'm sorry. I don't know what it means. Don't know what the lurk command does. Like, you're free to hang out and not chat, if that's what that means. Which is, I don't have a command for it. You know. And if that's what that means, I frankly don't see the need for a command. You just kind of do that. There's... I 
I don't know. Maybe it's just fucking Twitch boomer tired not understanding it. All right. Um You know, game, I would like you to not play spooky music. I know I'm stupid and a coward, but like. Oh, piss. Oh, wait, hold on. No, those are the stairs. Excuse me, bro. Wait, so... Makes me think that I've seen everything. Unfortunately. So... I can just get my way out of here. That's concerning. So I didn't find any lava there. Great. Which means that my only source might actually just been on this site a few years. Not sure myself. Oh, that was about the lurk command. My bad. Uh, yeah, no. My only source is... The fucking fire swamp. Which means that I can't get Tinker's tools until I, ca until I beat Mushroom. Or Minusroom. Ah, <sighs> fuck you, accidental balancing. Fuck you. Which means I need to gear up organically, which is a problem for my dumbass. 
Because I am a lazy motherfucker. And I don't want to deal with, uh, what's it fucking called? The Twilight. And... Sh Is my stream before or after Phantom Night? I usually handle it as a Hydra's, but I think it's actually a splitting branch. Actually, hold on, let me check. Uh, how do you make the Twilight Guidebook? Um... Traveler's logbook. I need an ink sack, feather. Oh, do I have a book and quill? I appear to not. A book. That's not very useful. Alright. Why is this covering that? Oh, you piece of shit. Well. I could put those in here. I need an ink sack, which I can get from squids, but I don't know if I've actually seen any yet. Like, I genuinely don't remember if I've ever seen any squids. There's pigs and... Well, not, but I don't know if I've ever seen a squid. Okay. Did I heard someone in VC? No, it was just a pig in game. I'm losing it. Actually, losing my goddamn mind. Streamer goes insane in front of two people. Anyways, that's a dark forest. Oh, for please, fellow of God, just let a squid spawn for fuck's sakes, there's plenty of water here. Also, the fucking dark tendrils spooked me for a second. Um, I haven't seen those since fucking season two of Tavern. And they were my deadliest weapon. Or one of my deadliest weapons. So, uh, you know, seeing those appear right out the corner of your eye, not fun. You're used to them just, you know, instantly killing people. Well, that's the end of that chunk of the river. And we didn't see a single goddamn squid. Or any lava. All that I'm dealing with right now is hearing my computer go. <laughs> so, yeah, there's that. Um. Let me look for more water. That way I can. Alright, so I went sh sideways and then ouch. Sh so that way is home. That way is southeast. Did I kill the Hydra at the end of last stream? Yeah, I did. I just didn't know if it was towards the end. Or if it was just, like, 
smack in the middle of all the random bullshit that happened. Uh, I don't see any squid. Could have sworn I've seen them before, though, so... I don't know. Maybe I'm losing it. A little random world of sprig. You haven't happened to see any squid around here, have you? Hold on, wait a minute. Uh, the fucking, uh, cursed tomes from the Lich Towers drop, uh, book and quills, right? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. All right, so there's seven different armor sets added by Twilight. Holy shit. Eh. Pain. Um... Right, yeah, no, this is probably going to get boring for you guys real quick. It's already boring me, so... Yeah. Don't think squid exist in the twilight. Which is a shame, but... Oh well. So, I need to head... That way. Uh, actually, hold on, I can use my atlas here. Uh, yep, for generalized... Uh, hold on, do I have a mod options? Options. Oh, happy International Women's Day. Yeah. I meant to use a grappling hook and not a torch, but okay, tired. I thought that ravine was a lot smaller than it actually was. I mean, it kind of was, but you know, but I didn't know it went that far. The hell? Why is there a house showing up over here? What? Is it the, uh, fucking den? The Yeti den shows up as a house on the map. Okay. Don't ask me about the topography of this map. I don't understand. Um, I'm not an expert on Twilight Forest topography. I am an idiot on the internet. Do not ask me to answer complicated questions. Please. For the love of God. And that's my domain over there. So I don't even need to cross the river. Twice. Oh, alright. 
I got nothing except a couple of sticks and saplings. So that run was a bust. I don't even know what I was looking for. I completely forgot what I was actually looking for. It wasn't lava, right? What was I looking for? Was it the autumnal biome? No, that, was not, that doesn't feel right either. What the fuck was I looking for? Chat, do y'all remember what I was looking for there? Because, <sighs> like, memory bad. <sighs> My back hurts. Um... So we're an hour in, and I've done basically nothing. Great. Give me a second to just scratch my leg. Um. Apparently, I just had a bunch of random seared bricks left. Um. What can I, What else can I use these for? Uh, stairs. Uh, fuel gauge, a lighter, cast chest, which I might actually need, but that requires me to actually fuel the forge so I can get a reasonable cast. Um, make a book. Oh, it can take cobblestone. Modify our work table. Look, can you not put this shit on normal stuff now? What do you do? Oh, so you take an enchanted item, and with the right stuff, you can pull it from it. Okay. That's interesting. Well, I don't need this. Don't think I have anything enchanted. That apparently was a lie. <coughs> okay.
Where did I get the aqua affinity from? Is it my trinket? I think it's my uh everlasting abilities. Yeah, well, that's it. I would have used the invis, but the invis is jank as hell, so no. Where is the leather? You make paper. I need to make two pieces of paper, or two books, so I can actually make the apotheotic tome to hold all the books. Hopefully, Twilight bookcases. Oh, you're shit me, really? Bruh. Alright, Kashyyyk Tome. So to scratch my ear. Uh, alright. Worm Document, Hex Notebook, Chronicles of Shadow, Lexica, Britannia, Encyclopedia, Arcana, Codex Arcana. Don't know if those two can go in. And an Atlas. Alright, let's see. Did my atlas lose it? No, it did not. Oh, hell yeah. Oh, because it's number... Yeah. Okay, well, that's all there. Um, Breathe underwater. You cannot breathe air. Mine three times faster underwater. 300% swimming speed. Could have been an Atlantean. Lava still? Don't have it. I am mad that I don't have it, but I do not have it. Because I can't go into... The fucking fire forest because of mosquitoes and mushroom. Or minus room. Why do I keep calling it the mushroom? I know the mushroom is just the basic bitch one, but like. Is that the recipe? Yeah, okay. Alright. As I said before, the current goal is to go kill the fucking, uh, what's it called? Goddamn lich. And maybe the minor shroom. <sighs> I need to kill the lich, because the lich drops the staff that you can use to clear the mosquitoes. And the minor shroom drops the uh, meef stair that you need in order to enter the fire forest. There's a very clear progression here. The problem is going the lich. Because the lich, on um, Boreal, is a pain in the ass. Like, not only is the fight itself super long, it involves a cool but needlessly complicated mechanic of deflecting the, uh, the fucking fireballs back at the thing. Uh, but it also just takes forever. Can I repair this anvil? I can use iron to repair it. Okay. That's night metal. I don't have any night metal. I have steel leaf and not night metal. You are getting prioritized. And this. Finally that. Okay. Good enough. That helmet's still gonna break. Alright. That's fine. The shield will be swapped. Hopefully instantly. Uh, where is my bow? Ah, in my inventory. Okay. I am actually going to go in the proper way to the Lich Tower. I'm going to start at the bottom and work my way up. Uh, just so I can get everything that I need. I don't know if there are rooms with lava in them. I'm praying to God there are. I think there are rooms inside of the Boarwood Tower. Uh, the house is Yorgast that actually has lava. But that one's more nether-themed, so that makes sense. This one's more like an evil scientist laboratory. And 
wow, this one folds in on itself a lot. <sighs> Goddamn crow. Scared the shit out of me. Heard a zombie noise and I was like, what the hell? Why do you have boots, dude? Bro's got fucking boots. That's the main room. We're not going there yet. Uh, you know, it would have been great to know that there were bookshelves right there. When I was just making, you know, an Akashic town. You know. Using books. Glowstone, don't need it. Loot? No, just a random ass bookshelf that apparently just looks like a chest to my dumb monkey brain. Uh, there's soul sand, actually. I can use that. I eventually want to summon the wither. Which is probably a very bad idea, but, you know, meh. Hell yeah, blaze powder. Spider eye. Pretty good axe, actually. Uh, actually. Great job, tired. Piece of shit. Um, I swear I didn't mean to make a pun. Uh, that's all good. Head back down here. It's another, okay, no, that's just another exit. Right, well. <sighs> Hopefully, possibly, if I just get into the swamp, I won't have to worry too much about lava. I might get lucky with generation and just get lava right off the bat. And there's a skeleton already. Right about spiders in this room, because there's a spider spawner up there. I think there is at least. I know there's a normal chest, and then. Well, I thought there was a secret chest. I'm sorry, Mr. Lich, for destroying your library. Right. I'll need all those. Oh shit. You know, we're getting some decent armor. Uh, I'm gonna have to keep what I have on right now because of the, uh, the health, but I'll try to pop the socket off later. Do I have a sword? I do not. Thank you, an idiot. Alright, where'd that skeleton go? I wonder if I can find it, because it was in the last pack. There's something I need to show you guys. About the paintings in here. There it is. What does this axe have on it? Depth mining, pierce damage, HP damage, armor piercing. But you know. The funny. That, that's what I wanted to show you guys. There's also one of dogs playing poker, but that doesn't irritate Sora nearly as much. That other one apparently elicits a completely visceral reaction. Like, what the fuck? Alright. Piss. Oh, happy I have three rows of hearts now.
You never know when shit's trapped. Even if it's, like, pretty fucking obvious that it's not. You never know. Is this the room with a secret? It, in fact, was not. Alright, I need to keep that on me. Everything else can... Actually, hold on. Might want this. Oh yeah, no. so I accidentally uh, threw out my enigmatic charm whenever I was trying to get home. But, that's okay. Um, I'll just count that as a cost for actually like flying to get home. Oh shit, we're already at the top? Hold on. Uh, actually, no, I do need that enigmatic charm, actually, uh, because of the soul crystals. So give that S. Should be the unwitnessed amulet. Uh, enigmatic item, escape scroll, Ethereum X, unwitnessed. U R S T Thick Scroll uh, Ultimate Potion Unholy Grail Unwitnessed Amulet. This is Spread Speed. Okay. Oh. All right. Also, that is a chunky ass spawner. I did not realize how fucking chunky the mob spawners here are. I do not want... No, I do want to keep that. Alright, how is my current shield doing? Awful. I'm replacing that before the fight. I'm going in with... Basically no potions. Alright. That would have been bad if I had that in here. Called oh, baseball. No, no baseball. Oh, no baseball. Okay, we're getting it. We're getting it. We're getting it. Baseball. I don't know if there's a certain one I need to hit. Go ahead and eat this right quick. I don't know if that one hit himself or what, but oh, that one probably did. Baseball, get ready for baseball. Just spam hit, I guess. All right. Oh, that did a decent chunk of his health. Okay. Whoa, okay. Heal. Am I actually going to first try this? Oh, no, he's enraged. That's an enraged. That's an enraged. Come on, get over here, fucker. Aha! Bring out your dead! <laughs> Alrighty, and that, I think, is the first time I've ever.
beaten Twilich first try. Alrighty. Scepter of life draining. Hmm. Alright. Whoa! First try, Twilich. I don't know if every previous time was just a fluke or. Hold on, is that what I think it is? Fucking. Finally. Two pockets. Two buckets of lava. It's a fucking Christmas already. Alright, well. Let's head home. Which way is home again? It is. Uh, this way. Whew. All right, so the lava is obtained, and if we need more, then we go to the fire swamp and sh get that. But for now, we have the lava we need in order to boot up the forge for the first time. And that means I can make myself a better fucking pickaxe. Maybe even a better axe, too. Because I might be able to make something better than... Uh, fucking, uh, what's it called? Iron. If I, or... Right now it's, uh, uh copper. So... Actually, hold on. I want to see if I can make a diamond... I cannot make any diamond tool parts. Okay. Uh, I need something that is diamond mining tier, though. Uh, blood brass, exanguinate is wood tier. Uh, blood rune, oh yeah, no, they're both wood. Fuck that. Uh, Nogget scale is stone, steel leaf is iron, fiery, night metal. Right, um, I need the pieces, not the comp not the actual things. All right, pickaxe heads. How do you make slime steel? Sky slime, seared stone, and iron. Oh shit, that's actually not. Oh, I can't get sky slime in here. Uh, amethyst bronze requires amethyst and copper. Don't think Amethyst Geode spawn here, so I'm shit out of luck there, too. Uh, Nahuatl requires Obsidian, which is unfortunate. Uh, pig Iron requires Honey, Blood, and Iron. Do I have any Honey? thought I did. Uh, I have one bottle. Uh, how much is needed for Pig Iron? Takes two ingots. Okay, so I just need... Two slime balls of blood and one piece of iron. And that'll get me a diamond mining tier pickaxe. And can I turn this into. No, I cannot. Okay. <sighs> Oops, sorry. I did not mean to blow air directly into my mic. I am so sorry. Um, right. I'm going to need food. Where is my food? Food. Put that there. Oh wait, no, I can't because that's full. Iron there. All right, prepare for hell. Or as close as twilight can get to it. Actually, no, that's not entirely true. The closest the twilight can get to hell is, um, hell. Actually, hold on. Before any of that, so I don't accidentally fuck up the numbers. How much blood is that? I need... Uh, pig iron. It is two slime balls. It is nowhere near enough.
Uh, two slime balls. There we go. Alright. And now... I forgot. I need... A... Hold on. Can I just right click a drain with this? Yep. Alright. Big iron. Oh wait, no. I also need gold. Uh, in order to make the ingot cast. So one piece of gold and I'll just use a seared brick. I like it's an audible click now. Uh, still need gold, and I also need to make a uh, cast for the uh, Pickaxe head itself. You need to be careful because this thing only has. Yeah, no, it doesn't have very long. Luckily, it turns itself off very quickly. It also burns through very quickly. Come on, don't, don't run out. Alright, pig iron head, durability still shit, but that's okay, I'll put that there, uh, these can go in here. Oh, so the Twilight Lich makes blaze noises. That's why I was hearing blazes. I thought I was just going nuts. No. No, it, it just makes blaze noises. Okay. Actually, I'll put potions in the uh, chest over here. No, no, the uh, armor that I have on is just straight up better than this. Uh, so I can put that away. Fire damage taken is reduced by 19%. On using. I need a. There we go, I'll just put that on. It's 57%, but. I was an idiot and put my best one there first. I 
Uh, that's not it, is it? Uh, this is the mattock for logs, dirt, sand, gravel, and plants. Just don't take your own grave. Uh, so small axe, head tool, handle, round plate. I think I already have a round plate, so... I just need to make the rest of it. I wonder... Hmm... Alright, one point. I'm looking for mining speed and durability. So 9, 1.5, 1, 2, 1. This one averages out to be better. Plus, cultivate is arguably a better perk. Plus, it already has stone, it already has stone bound. So. Um, uh, yep, stone, copper, matic. Uh, dwarven cultivated. Diamond mining tier. So I think I can mine uh that was iron. Harvest your gold. Pick head round plate. Oh motherfucker, you're averaging me out. Alright, I need uh gonna make an iron round plate, I guess. Uh Iron tier. Uh, uh, what is raw iron? Is that there's is there a difference? T mm -hmm. All right. Uh, let me just go ahead and make the. Round plate. I need how much iron do I need for that? It is two ingots. I can't turn this into anything with that, can I? No. Uh should let me see what the Naga Steel uh tier is. Stone. You know, so stone would just be screwing me over again. And I need a piece of gold. Iron and gold aren't gonna alloy in there, right? Uh gold sh no copper and gold make rose gold. Still need more lava, but Hurry up. The forge is going to start cooling. No? Okay. Iron round plate. Put that on the axe now. So, hopefully. Wait, no, was it the axe? The pickaxe. Harvest your iron. Harvest your iron. That makes it a harvest your iron still. No, gold was the. Oh, piss. God damn it. This is the one that I wanted to put the uh, iron round plate on. There's probably not going to be enough lava in there for this. No fuel found. No, piss. God fucking damn it. Fuck you! Alright, well... Hey, at least now I have a fucking iron 
max. All right, well, that's there. Um, I guess now I just head over to the fucking fire swamp. I'm going to grab a um, healing potion, just in case. And I am also going to finally try and equipping to equip my, uh, there's, no, that's rage, I want healing. Uh, Attack damage seven. Attack damage seven. That is HP damage and armor piercing now. So there. I don't know if I'm gonna need that for the minus room, but you know, who knows? Alright, so the den is this way and that way. I think that's the swamp, possibly. I might be wrong. Uh, there's another Naga over there. Hey, if I need Naga scales, I know where to look, but at the moment, I do not need Naga scales. I need to go find the fucking swamp. Yeah, it should be this way. Uh... So home from here is northeast. Uh, that's the final plateau. That is not where I need to go. I need to go to the swamp, which I think is next to the final plateau. Wait, did I? Nope. I thought I mis I thought I for a second I misinterpreted that uh hollow hill. But no, 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 I was Shapes of Fish. What the fuck is that thing? Is that a That's a plant. I thought that was an arrow at me. Uh that's the lower half of a ball and chain goblin. Okay. Where it spawns twilight? Question mark? <laughs> right now, I think we're headed the right way. Though, again, I could be completely wrong and just going in a fucking circle, but... Honestly, at this point, like, now that I figured out that I could just use my atlas to break that circle, I'm okay with making it a little bit. I keep her there a little bit. Um, like, I've begun to accept that sometimes that's just what happens. And I fell in a hole. God damn it. So, I'm thinking there's going to be another swamp that way. Maybe that's what I'm mixing up. Yeah. Might be mixing up my Naga mazes. I don't know. There's a fair number of them around. So, you know, they're pretty easy to mix up and whatnot. There's the swamp. I see the I see the vines. Alrighty. So all I need to do now is find the fucking minus room den, and I think I actually already know where it is. I think it's near that tree. Cause I saw it while I was walking by. Looking for my house. Yep, that's it over there. Alright. And I'm not seeing the mosquitoes. So, I think we're good. Oh 
Oh shit. Hexeray? Hexeray shit spawns there? Can I use these mangrove? This mangrove stuff for a Hexeray? Uh. It appears I cannot. Okay. Fair enough. And I just somehow. Oh no, I was clicking the wrong thing. Okay. Well. <sighs> I forgot I was going to try and use my invisibility in here. I don't need water breathing while I'm on the surface. Go away. Invis. This is going to be jank as hell because as you see my hand flickering it only lasts for one second before it just pops back again. Which means that shit can technically see me for a singular second and then I'm back. I was just going to be boom, 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 boom. That might actually cause some issues, but it's okay. We'll work with it. A better invisibility will probably be found later. I forgot. Oh, this place actually has lava. Motherfucker. Piss off. Oh, you're shitting me. Really, dude? Are really gonna do that to me? Fuck off with that bullshit. I'm bringing a bucket of water with me. I'm not doing with that again. Alright, so. As I said, um, invisibility's a little jank right now. I'm not going to need that while I'm in there. <sighs> Luckily, it's not like... Actually, no, it'd probably be better if it was light-dependent visibility, because then I would actually be in, like properly invisible, and not just as bullshit pseudo-invisibility. And I heard that. Yeah, I, I heard that. Fuck you. <sighs> okay, so... Oh, hey, maze map focus already? Damn. Uh... Probably not gonna need that. Uh, need this on me. This. This, just in case. Can I? I cannot. So let's say, can I use that as a tank or a bucket? And the answer was no. Well, there's currently five buckets of lava in there. It's only just now reaching the, uh, actually enough to be visible inside of the tank point. So, you know, that's promising. Oh, the torch is not lava. I want the lava one, not the torches one. Like that. Uh, 
So that's the next level. Piece of shit. Why didn't you have a pickaxe instead of an axe? Oh, that's why. A diamond effectiveness steel leaf axe. Lovely. Oh, hey, mace slimes. Actually, lovely. They think these guys can drop slime cores. They could drop slime balls, but I think they can also drop slime hearts. Maybe. I might be wrong. Apparently, they can also drop charms of life? I'm not complaining, but I am confused. Torches. Torches. I want lava, damn it. That's not the room. The room itself is fenced off. I know that, because that's how I cheese the boss. I just don't deal with the fences. I just put one hole and smack him in the face from there. There's a spawner room nearby, though. Tell that from all the noise. Uh, that's only a gold tier, so actually, since this thing has diamond effectiveness against everything, I'm going to be using it. Uh, there's Maystone right there, so that's not the way to go. Uh... Motherfucker. Piss off. Also, that's not supposed to be dropping from normal mobs with a normal weapon. That is only supposed to be dropping from uh, things killed with a meat cleaver or bone claws. Don't ask me why it is dropping from things with a normal weapon. I'm not the mod dev. I can't answer that question. Fucker. Don't, don't do that. Does that one also have a spawner in it? No. I swear, if this room ever gets updated to have traps in it, I am going to be very sad. Scared at first, and then very sad. Scared, because it'll probably jump scare me. That's not the way. Is it? It's not there. It's not there. It's not there. Hey, random trident. Uh, don't need the sticks. I really don't need the sticks. Where the fuck is it then? If it's not there. Then is it this way? Uh, a lot of fence here, but mushrooms here.
magnetize. I'll put that on and then I'll immediately take it off. Because that just seems like it'd be annoying. But, I'll keep in mind the fact that I have it. I don't know why the hits from this axe feel way more satisfying than hits with any other axe that I have. It might just be like that sweeping thing. But it actually feels like it's doing shit. You know? Uh, that ain't it. Um, did I just come through here? I think I just did. So that ain't it. Um... This isn't it either, question mark. Unless it's free. You know, no, it's not. It's not because mushrooms in the corners are in the boss arena. But it's a new room, so I might be getting close. You know, sometimes I wish that I'd just bring, like, a shitload of redstone comparators with me. And instead of, like, destroying all the spawners, I just turn them off. Like, that is infinitely more funny than just, oh, well, break spawner. No, just, just, just shut up. You're, d d just turn off. Aha, there it is. Hello, minus shroom. Hi. You know, oh, fuck sakes, really? The slime beetle is a more dangerous thing? Huh? Oh, hello! <laughs> ah, so you heard all my maniacal rambling. Yeah, about electrical beetle. Why? Why can't I play D2? Like, it's not letting me play a D2. Uh, by not letting you play it, do you mean in the sense that you haven't bought $120 worth of DLC? Due to increased traffic, login service is adjusting to are currently being throttled. Oh yeah, no, people are just constantly logging in. That's all that's going on. You're just in the queue. Well, they find a problem with it so I can get higher in the queue. Yeah, well, you're probably not going to go anywhere, because... Shadow? Are you in queue? You are? Alright, that's it. Get in here. I'll take your spot. This might just be like a me opinion, but I don't think a spine is like enough to satiate the bungee gods in order to move you in the queue. I think he knows. He's laying on my bed staring at me. Yeah, he knows. He's just staring. Menacingly. Yeah. He knows that no matter how much you insult him and call him fat, you still love him and you're still gonna feed him. Yeah, he was a fat little boy. That's all he was. Why are you sh- that game's not even on. 
Wait, why? Wait, when did they add this? Why? I opened Steam Come Board and immediately I found out they added Cold War to Steam. Uh, uh, okay. For a moment, I was very confused. I was wondering what the fuck is going on with Steam. And both concerned and confused. Oh. Below 8% max health. Inflict Sundering, which means enemies take more damage, I believe. Shit. Okay. I'll take it. Uh, minor Shroom Trophy. Alright, maybe stroke off it now. I just gotta find my way the fuck out of here. Because I don't have Waystone. Fuck. I'm so confused. Why did they add this? Why did they add this game to this? Ow. I didn't ask you, Shadow. <laughs> did he mail? Yeah. I heard, I think I heard that actually. I don't know why I asked if he mailed if I heard it, but. But if he just meowed at me, like, like, hey, he added it to the cam. Yeah. The cat's right. I hate to argue with the cat. I mean, agree with the cat, but the cat's right. It was, okay, the reason why I'm confused is Black Ops Cold War came out three years ago and they, and they, now just put it on the Steam store. I don't know. Like, fucking Treyarch having a moment, I guess. I'm not complaining. I actually like Cold War. Where do I go? Wait, where do I get paid? Counter Strike. Okay. There's a lot of shit in here. I get paid on the 15th. Okay. I hate ranged attackers. I hate them so much. Still in the queue. You're I fucked. Just play, <laughs> I just want to play some Vanguard. You want to do strikes? Yeah, that's what I'm doing. That's, that's what I want to do. I want to do strikes. I just want to like get stuff. Do bounties. Yeah, well, Bungie says fuck you. Yeah, it's the 23rd player. Why that puts a knife in my plans? So I get paid on the fifteenth, which is why I'll be paying you. But also, there's another dilemma. Mm. I th I thought I don't know why my brain thought I was being paid on the twenty second of March. No, but I'm gonna be buying the RE4 remake because I I stream I've been streaming Resident Evil, so I want to stream Resident Evil. And the game comes out literally a week after I get paid, and so I'm like, I buy it? That's what I'm contemplating. I'd wait and see how reviews are. It's for... literally just a remake, and I, there's been so many positive things about the game, so I might actually get it. I'm willing to put in the extra 10 bucks just to get the deluxe edition. Hmm. You know, like, saying, like, oh, deluxe, probably, like, like eight, like eighty, ninety. No, it's only seventy. It's hmm. crazy. The sounds, please let me play Destiny Two. I think I think this might be a mercy. Like as a Destiny player, do not play Destiny. <laughs> I want I want to do strikes. Just turn your brain off. Or do you not turn your brain off whenever you do strikes? I do, I do turn my brain off. I literally, I listen to one song and repeat, and that's a double trigger. Uh, <laughs> I will listen to the, ironically, the Devil May Cry 5 soundtrack while playing Destiny 2. Loads in the Devil's Lair. <laughs> your connection to Destiny 2 character service has been lost. Please check your network. Yeah, servers might be shitting Those themselves. Server code chicken. Oh, yep, yep. You got chicken. Okay. Yeah, no. Fucking chicken. I'm gonna make a chicken and turn it into KFC. Chief, I am losing my mind. <laughs> so am I. I am uh, stuck inside of this goddamn maze. 
How the fuck did I end up back here? No matter what, when I get, when I get paid, I'm going to um, just to pay you, you know, I'm going to buy the uh, Pool of Torment DLC because I really want to buy that. How sad is it for me to tell you that I own almost every single DLC in Dead by Daylight? It's not sad if you enjoy it. I missing the head case, Bloodstained Sack, 80 suitcase, and the Killer and Survivor expansion pack. That's it. Hmm. Do I still have the like massive BRB on my screen? No, I don't. Okay. Yeah, I was just making sure. Um. Yeah, this sounds so ironic. Dabadali is the only game where you can play as Cheryl Mason teaming up Forrest Ryan Ash Williams and Bill Overbeck to fight against the Devil Gorgon in a raccoon city. I don't think that's exactly it's, ironic, but interesting. No, it's ironic. It's literally so many characters from different things. Like Cheryl Mason from the Paranormal Silent Hill, Laurie Shrove from the Slasher Halloween, Ash Williams from the Campy Slasher of Evil Dead, Bill, you probably know, Left no. Dead. No. Do you not know? Why do many people not know Left 4 Dead? Uh, also, uh, yeah, no, you're using the word wrong. Anyways. So I, why do I still have the invisibility on? This shit doesn't even fucking work. Okay, invisibility goes back in the jar. Yeah, no, there's no way hell I'm getting out of here proper. No, no, I'm not going to make a habit. I'm not going to make a habit of it. Oh, wait, I just reminded myself I need to install something. And I hope it's not a virus. But that, but that doesn't give me confidence. Oh, shit. The staff actually unlocks the dark forest and the snow forest? Downward. How big are you? Ah, oh, motherfucker. Download plutonium.exe. Okay. Where Plutonium. the fuck is the goddamn exit? I want to exit. leave. I want exit. out. I want to be gone. I do not like it here. Okay. Oh, yeah, I just realized. Let me open your stream so you don't watch your stream. Oh, I'm three followers away from 100. Nice! I am, actually. <laughs> I, I literally, it felt like like, a, like last week when I had just reached, uh... When I, when I had just reached, uh... Like, 50. Yeah, because you've I been farming Geometry Dash. <laughs> <laughs> like, farming bots with Geometry Dash. Like, what? That's true. So I Do you even know if they're bots or like actual people? Actual people. Actual people come to my stream. Mind you, the whole question of are they bots is not against you. It is a wonder of how the fuck are there so many people still interested in Geometry Dash? As all that shit died out in like 2012. I went on my phone and looked at my stuff. Uh, like, I just looked at my phone, checked, like, my YouTube, and under most of my John Trash things, it said, copyright claim. I'm like... Oh, yeah. Serious. Copyrighted music. Well, get beaned. Yeah. And manage videos. What the fuck? Yeah. Uh, yeah. Oh, oh Fuck. God fucking damn it! Restrictions copyright. Copyright protected content found. The owner allows content to be used on YouTube. So, it isn't... So You're not immediately getting beamed. It's just YouTube saying, hey, watch out. I'm just gonna not... I'm just not gonna upload Left 4 Dead videos. No, I mean, not Left 4 Dead. Fucking... Show me your dash. Yeah. You know, that, that might just be your safest bet. Yeah, plutonium. I don't have an account. You never give me a. But the thing I'm selling is plutonium. Plutonium is a way for you for me to play older CODs on dedicated servers. 
Mm. And I'm actually excited. I like, and it's the good COD games too. It's like Black Ops One, Two, World at War, Modern Warfare Three. It's actually really good. Hmm. Neat. I wish I. I feel like I'm gonna be called out, but I wish I could. Do, I wish someone could do the same with uh, Destiny One on PC because I'd love to replay. D One isn't even on PC. Yeah. It's only on a uh, PS3, PS4, and uh, the Xboxes before uh, the. Oh, for fuck's sakes! Register. Uh, password. Don't read that aloud. <laughs> yes, I'm naming my password. Your mom is a bitch. Oh no, I've heard dumber passwords. I ridiculed my uh, manager uh, when I was at work Sunday. That is a very dangerous thing to do. My teacher, uh, not not your manager, who's like, I remember, I think she said she was thirty. She didn't know the video knew my new mom on YouTube. Okay. I don't know what that is. You don't? How? How? I need you, okay, I need you to understand that for the majority of my life, I was not allowed to go on the internet. Like, basically at all. So, I know jack shit about anything that came out before I was in a late middle school, early high school. So. The new Manoma is just some guy, some, like, fat guy in, like, a white shirt lip-syncing to a Romanian song. It... What? I, you know what? I... I'll be real. Should... I don't care enough to really figure it out. Oh, wait, when did the video come out? Let me see here. The video came out 16 years ago. That explains a lot. I don't want that. This, 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 and that. Okay. Alright, I have 11,000 in lava that I can put away. I can store 4, 8, 12,000 of lava back home. Oh, fuck. At least it's not an apotheotic enderman. If it was, I'd be absolutely fucking screwed. I forgot. My... In a server, I'm gonna play a bunch of IRL friends. You know what they named? <laughs> Guess what the lol one of my friends has? Uh oh. Mr. Can't Swim Man. Mr. Can't Swim Man? Yeah, it's his leaf lover. And then there's just a silly cat in the videos. Hmm, I wonder who that is. Uh, it's like a bunch of people. Oh, that's a role, not a uh, not a name. My bad. I was about to say that's just a name. I, that not. Wait, wait, hmm. Where the fuck is the fucking? I was given the role of diabetic, and I, I'm even not. I, I don't. Okay, I am actually losing my goddamn mind because of this stupid fucking maze. I. Is this what? What's the, what's the fucker with the with the thread who killed the minotaur? Uh, was it these? Uh, was it, no, it wasn't Theseus. That was ship dude. Uh, uh don't say Theseus around me because my brain almost goes. So, have you heard about the ship of Theseus? Was it was it Heracles? No, that wasn't it. Uh, the the motherfucker who killed the minotaur. Uh. I used to know this. I used to know this. Uh. It's a, it was a, it's a dude who wanted, like, the quest to, like, do something, right? That happens in every Greek story. Like, that that, that, that narrows nothing down. <laughs> like, the dude who was, like, put, put on several quests. Like, uh, the there's nine labors of Hercules or Heracles. Yeah, was it, was it not Hercules? He's playing the Minotaur? No, I... No, he killed the Hydra and the light on. I think at least he killed the light on in order to get the golden apple. Greek. He's 
We killed him or something. Or something. Theseus. I thought Theseus was the fucking boat guy. When the third time of sacrifice came, the Athenian hero Theseus volunteered to go, go in with the help of someone, daughter of Minos and Thurs. He killed the monster and ended the tribute. Oh, the Athenian hero Theseus tied up some loose ends of the story. He killed the, the Cretan bull of uh, Marathon later. He sailed the Crete, found his way to the center of the labyrinth, and killed the Minotaur. It was Theseus. Alright. Okay, there is no way in hell I am getting out of here without no clipping. Like, this is fucking ridiculous. You're no clipping. Or, oh. not no clipping, fucking uh, spectator mode. Uh, either way, you know what I mean. Right. I've been running around for, like, I've got no how long. I don't want to make this a constant because I had to do this yesterday as well, but like, how, like, um, where even was the exit? I was on the complete wrong side of the fucking thing in order to get out, okay. Wow, thanks game. And then the last exit was over here, so I'm just going to go up. I can't believe you're cheating, Connor. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> All right. That was annoying. Uh, now that I have actually handled the minus room, I can actually go into the fire swamp. The fire swamp is where I really want to go, so I can actually get lava, so I can fuel my tinker forge. Yes, that is why I want to go to the tinker. That's why I want to go to the fucking fire swamp. Nerd. Shut. I'm not mm -hmm. a nerd. Actually, no, I am, but, but, but that's besides the point. I could see a February recap of you. What? Oh yeah, no, because you're a mod. February recap. Let's see what you made happen this month. The subscriber of Tired Arts. There's gonna be a singular person there. I'm telling you that right now. Actually, no. Wait, no, no. There's not, because that person subscribed in March. There's, there's, there, there's nothing there. I don't even think I streamed last month. Stream 16 hours and 48 minutes. Okay, apparently I am wrong. <laughs> Tired, tired Arts Community Theater email has been tired, uh, tired A at Panic. Ah. The green, the green bird. Yeah, the tired parrot. Tired Arts Community sent 250 messages this month, as in February. Yeah. Tired Arts streamed 30 times this month. What was that? Tired Arts was streamed three times this month. Yeah. Uh, total month subscribed one. Top so clip from Fe top clip from February. No clips were created in this time period. Yep, as I said, I don't think anything happened last month. Like, uh, lately yeah. I've just had to like focus on more IRL shit, so I haven't actually had time to stream or anything. I was given the one month badge. Yippee. Enjoy! Congratulations! You've stuck around with my bullshit for a significant amount of time. I, li I like helping a friend out. Cause why not? I am a dumb, friendly person. Fair enough. Not, not much torment myself for playing Dead by Daylight. Ah oh, yes, dumb, friendly person. A dumb, friendly person casually plays game where I murder people. Still can't play. They they give a bikini skin to fucking uh to a skull merchant on release. <sighs> Apparently, they know what their community is about. <laughs> yeah, well, you know what I mean. I will every time I look at your stream and I see the hydro health bar, I get PTSD. Oh no! What happened? Tavern happened. Wait, yeah, what? Tavern, tavern. You Wait, what? Apollo, you don't remember when Apollo put me through a trial? 
He pulled me through a gauntlet of like the Crimson Cult, the Hydra, all just to give me a staff where I could teleport without taking damage. Ah, so abusing mod powers. Got it. Mm -hmm. And then he... I don't know if it was Sora, or it was Sora or him, who put either Sora or Apollo into like an arena to fight the dudes with swords in their backs. I think Sora did that to Apollo. I... Okay, I'm gonna be completely honest with you. I don't want to talk about tavern stuff. Fair enough, that's fair. They look like a bitch. What? The thing you're fighting. Uh, it's the Hydra, so yeah. Oh, Mega Bitch. Mega Bitch. Oh, podcast. I've been uh, listening to frequently distractible. They recently put out like a new episode. So we'll just tell the there's some of the podcast episodes have like two episodes a week. God damn it, I'm on fire about. again. But they released an episode today where they actually they're starting to do like videos now, so you can actually watch them if you want, which I like. Hmm. And what's the difference between the podcast and the YouTube video? Like, no, it's not a YouTube video. On Spotify, you can watch the video, so you can just just watch them. I hate how I actually on the full Valentine's outfit for that slinger. What was the outfit called? The outfit called the King of Hearts. I want to test something. And this is a dumb thing. Tyler, I not... Don't do it. I want to grapple the Hydra. I don't think you can grapple onto an entity. No, you can, and it usually launches them. Come on, where's your damn fireballs? I got an outfit for a character recently for Claudette, who, I don't know why, her outfit reminds me of your typical, like, like, D&D cosplayer. Like, dresses like, like, she's dressed as, like, an elf. Like, a, you took, like, a witch. That Elvis. Elvis is my, can't speak. Harry. No, Harry, I'm gonna dox you, territory father. Ah, dox a cat. Hell yeah. Are you mad? He's mad. The cat is I don't know how to actually do this fight. I don't know. Oh, wait, hold on. Am I supposed to hit the fireballs back? Is that what I'm supposed to do here? Cause well, like, 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 well, like a cat. Yeah, or the Twilight. No, because the fireballs are, don't, like, actually go too far. So I'm gonna have to shoot them back. And pray I don't run out of arrows. I wanna punch some people in the face. I'm gonna play Nemesis. I thought you were just, like, shitposting. No, no, you are actually going to try and punch people in the face. Is that, like, actually how his abilities work? Uh, whenever he, like, so, literally, his main attack is punching someone, but his power is the tentacle. Have you ever won against a nemesis? I think I won against one when you, me, and Nam played. Yeah, it's just literally, hey, tentacle whip. Every time he hits this person, his power get built up. Go from tier one, tier two, then tier three. Tier 2, he can break palace. Tier 3, he can recover from successful and missed attacks a lot faster and break palace faster. Hmm. I think. Uh. Your power extends to mutation rate. Mutation rate 2, tentacle strike can destroy palace and breakable walls. Mutation 3, tentacle strikes range and movement speed increase when it's fully charged and two-part. You can split the current mutation rate. Uh -huh. Um, English, please. <laughs> I don't know what any of that means. Okay. Mutation rate two. He can break walls and pallets. Three. He can just he can do it. He can do that, but from a longer range and a bit faster when when held for a short duration. Hmm. Dude, what perks am I running? Uh. Strength, placing, broken chili, anatomy. 
Isn't this just better than the Sphere and Lottery? Uh, I actually have an idea. Lethal Pursuer. Other reason. Mm -hmm. When you start the trial, I get to see the survivor's uh, orbs for eight seconds, but at any time a survivor's orb is shown for a period of time, its duration is increased by two seconds. For a chili, I can see a survivor from the dirt, I can see their aura. So, for four seconds. But now, it'll be up to six seconds. That's a two second increase. I don't think that's really worth it. Two seconds is a big time in the Hmm. What? Uh, what does this one look like? Oh, just shifts for this one. Can I make. It's just one more I'm going to play for this game. Stick. Feather. And I need two flinch and. Four wood. One, two, three, four. Wait, wait, hold on. Does that go to. No, that doesn't make sense! What? So, the best thing I have is called the King of Hearts. On his back is literally the spade. Oh. <laughs> Probably King of Hearts because of the Valentine skin, but I mean, this weapon, Lovebird's Wing Shot. Hmm. This new customized weapon will make lovers' hearts hearts beat faster. I love how, and it, like in the DB chat, someone goes, "Hey, I don't think I could do much for DVD story." Me casually lore dumps a bunch of bad Dead by Daylight. <laughs> I am essentially you for Dead by Daylight. You're like like you are a nerd for Destiny too, but I'm a nerd for DVD. Mm. You know so much about D two, but I don't. I mean, like yeah. you're an encyclopedia for Destiny too. I wouldn't say encyclopedia, but I do know a lot. Like, frankly, more than I really should. Like, it is a concerning a lot amount how much I focus on that game. Actually, wait, I've heard the prayers. Game of Flute. When you're chasing that session, the spark activates. Damaging a generator and breaking walls or pallets gives you a 5%. Oh, that is actually kind of good. Why is this harvester gold? It has fucking. Uh. Oh, fuck! God damn it, iron and diamond are canceling each other's out. Ah, pain. I, I found something that's actually pretty good. Mm. Uh, while you're chasing obsession, the spark activates. Damaging a generator and breaking a wall or pallet gives you a 5% hate stat for 10 seconds. Haste means you move faster. So, that means... Wait, whenever, whenever you hit the survivor with the total most time in chase basic attack, that becomes such... Essentially, if you're chasing your obsession, kick a pick, kick a pallet, you can run slightly faster, so you can catch up. Hmm. Uh. Leverage. You show me like a survivor gain one token every ten. You know if a survivor just spark activates for thirty seconds for each token. Reduces the speed at which survivors heal at five percent. Not bad. Be better. Oh my god, this is actually a whack. I feel like a survivor in this park activates. The next break will wall or pallet you break to make sure survivors switch. Oh my god, that's kind of busted. Not only do you make the survivor scream, they, that happens when you break a pallet. You know what else happens if you break a pallet with a spell mission perk? You can go fast. Oh. Alright, let me play an M1 Killy and then try something. Let me play the Nightmare. Freddy fucking Krueger. So, I'm gonna test a little build. Brutal Strength. Oh, I don't have a helmet. Uh, where is her? Okay, Game of Foot. 
Uh, not doing that much. I need a head helmet. I don't have a helmet on. Whack, and then. Yeah, I'll make different bits. Is that the clicker from The Last of Us? No, just random stimming. Recently opened XP gauge with block for fifth plane. Also, hold on. This mic picks that up, but the other one doesn't? What? They're literally the same headset. The only difference is the port. One's a USB and the other one's a aux cord. Like, what the fuck? Bruh. Uh, did I go the right way? Well, I can just circle back around. Um, I am sorry that I am not talking very much. Brain is just kind of bleh, you know? Yeah. My brain's like going bird. I think I found a decent build. That's good. As I'm doing brutal strength, which allows me to break stuff faster. Uh, game of foot. Every time I break a pallet or wall while chasing an obsession, I will gain speed. And something about obsession will become a new person will become obsession. Uh, black makes people scream so I can see their aura, and then. Joel, anytime I don't survive with my basic attack, they will. Anything about your real will blow up. Hmm. Oh, you gave me the Knights map? I don't want to play this map. Interesting. Oh, I have to hold. Can I do it? Ew. Don't have any more apotheotic gems, do I? No. Feck. Um, Hello, Detective Taft from the hit from the hit movie franchise Saw. Alright, that's two generators blown up. Alright, what is this used for in order to make the blood tablet? Um Okay, I need Polished blackstone, redstone, and lava. I can maybe possibly get blackstone if I can find the right spot. Or maybe not. Probably not, actually. Jake fucking fart. Oh, no. Where is swiftness? There it is. Alright. So, I'm about to do something real fucking stupid. See how fast I am already, right? I have speed because of uh, my armor and I think also everlasting abilities. Well, oh, I don't think that's stacked. Well, hopefully I'll get there in a decent time. I, I got my... I know, I do need to clean my vitality from the Hydra. I forgot about that. I was like, why is my health so low? No, it wasn't because I was wearing an apotheotic item. It's because my vitality got sapped whenever I fucking died. Nerd. Yeah. Hello. <laughs> I saw you come in here. You can't scare us. Haha. <laughs> oh, spook. Right. Nerd. I had to mute because I was coughing. Alrighty. Ha, ha, ha. Be nice. 
Oh. Ah, yeah, the basic human stuff. Yes. Be nice. Uh, All right. Huh. I'm gonna a spirit through someone's chest. So, update. I, uh, for you, sorry, I have killed the Twilich and the Minus Room, and I'm headed to finish off the Hydra. The Hydra killed me because I was not immune to fire or explosions. So, but skill issue, explosions I guess. Hurt. Yes, explosions do hurt. They also break your armor, which is dumb. But, meh. Be oh. yeah. Be. No. fucking eight four slices of pizza I feel like I'm about to explode F that's weak I ate five yesterday okay <laughs> chief usually I can eat a whole fucking thing yeah same but here's the funny problem right now it's not a competition guys it's okay <laughs> it's not a competition <laughs> no. okay uh, usually I can eat the whole thing but recent issue I've my stomach has... I used to have a bottomless stomach. I found the bottom. Ah. And it, it, it's this fucking Stanley Parable bottomless hole. It's just getting smaller and smaller every time I put something through it. Oh, my water-breathing helmet's gone. Oh. Wait, no, I took off my water-breathing... Uh... Ability. It wasn't a helmet at all. I'm a fucking dumbass. Great job. Uh, like my helmet broke, right? And I, for a second I thought, oh yes. It... Actually, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Not only have I thought that helmet gave me health, because whenever I died I completely forgot about the enigmatic legacy thing of me losing vitality whenever I die. I also forgot that the fucking helmet did not give me respiration. That was 100% uh... Endless abilities or everlasting abilities because. Ye yeah, I forgot that. Like an Me. idiot. Where the fuck is this goddamn Hydra? Is it. Oh, it's further in. I have to hurry so it doesn't heal itself. Did someone just type in chat? I saw movement out the corner of my eye. Let me tell you, make it one. Five feet is each. First, first to finish, go. What? I saw. I saw. We both get five pizzas. Whoever finishes all five wins. Pizza Tower. <laughs> what? Ah. Uh, you think okay. I understand what's going on anymore? Apparently, chat not, is uh, ca challenging you both to eat five entire pizzas. No. Oh no, Ben! No. Just no. It's not happening. <laughs> I'd rather die right now. <laughs> the food coma's already bad enough. Why is that thing going after my soul gem and not me? What the hell? Will you, old man? No, is it going after my soul gem? Where the fuck is my soul gem? I will play Destiny 2, but it's forcing me to play Dead by Daylight. Uh, F. I did not mean to open my atlas. That is a very bad thing to do in a very dangerous area. Where is my a Oh. That is a terrifying move when all the fireballs start going at once. Uh, did you, did you make sure to rip off your own skin to put on your blast-resistant skin? Uh, not yet. You should probably do that. Yeah, I probably if, if should. Tap, I'm going to send the spear right through your chest and make sure you bleed. Bitch. This thing is fucking terrifying. I did not know it was actually this dangerous. I usually cheesed it and I did not realize that they uh, updated it. Anti-cheese now. 
Anti cheese. Oh, that's good for the last person tolerant, but. Oh, me, so... no. <laughs> oh, it's. Oh, that means it'll be good for me. Even though I will eat an entire pizza. But. <clears throat> okay, that head's gone. I just got sniped by a filth. Oh, you play an ultra kill? Yeah. Cyber grind time. Yeah. I want just... to play a different game thing. I, I want to take away from John Trash, but I don't know what to play. Do, should I play Tattletale? No. Leave that game to die and rot where it belongs. Why rot? It's a game! Anything yeah. that even slightly relates to Herbie needs to die. <laughs> Is that why you don't want to open it? Yes. Yeah, this was a good game. It's a good water. Piece of shit. Fucking loser. I'm gonna kill you. Come on, a couple more. <laughs> ah, filth! Oh, my friend just explained there's some why he added Black Ops Cold War to uh, to Steam because they want because they want more money. Yeah. Activision's greedy, and so they're like, hey, let's just put. Dragon Slayer! And only took two attempts. Nice. Do you want a Hello, sticker Maurice. for that side? What? You want a sticker? Yeah. This just, just gives you a smiley face sticker. <laughs> Dragon Slayer! Comic Sam's Dragon Slayer. No, it doesn't even spell dragon right, it's dragon, like, like, with a, with an M. Dragon. Dragon Slayer. Wait, Mar God damn it. Maurice has ended me. Maurice? F. As in Maurice the Horse from the hit horror game Dead by Daylight? No, Maurice is in The Rock. <laughs> Jake, I'm gonna impale you. Bitch. Jake from State Farm? What? Yeah. I'm scared to, I'm scared to customize the bots because if I give the bots like a a flashlight, they will actually abuse the flashlights and it's scary. The bots abuse the flashlights. Yes, if you don't run light form, they will chain blind you. <laughs> I've experienced it way too many times. What did they all like huddle together and just go boom 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 boom? No, they will just get no. Where the flashlight will repeatedly blind you. How? I thought there was like a cooldown to be blinded. No, there is no cooldown. Oh, the fucking skill issue, I guess. Um. Does need to work? I'm not sure. Definitely. Um. Uh. Only do it if you have the seasonal content. Otherwise, no one's gonna watch you. Just straight up. If you don't have the DLCs, no one's going to watch you do strikes. Because strikes are boring. Everyone can do those. Uh, or everyone has access to them. And honestly, if you want to watch a strike, just sit back and pray that you get a speedrunner in your fire team. Every person I, I, I play a uh, strike team with are always like speedrunners. Yeah, because no one, no one does the strikes to play the strikes. They're doing it for the loot. They just want it to be over as fast as fucking possible. Who like, doesn't? Uh, people that you match make with specifically for that. Um, <laughs> like you will have to LFG in order to find someone who doesn't try to fucking speedrun a strike. That, that that's just how that works. My friends got to a fight over Destiny Two, saying. I, like my uh, my friend, I'll say Reckon Reggie. He kept saying, "Hey, like they don't like a lot of people in like Xbox working for groups. They will always not allow Titans." And then my other friend, show my pants, will go, "Yeah, I bet I was invited to show looking for groups as a Titan." It's like, no, they don't like Titans. And they just argue, but 
Oh, they don't like black. Titans. <laughs> this is like Titan discrimination. <laughs> Can you be racist against a class? I, I think it's classist. Like I think, like by definition, it is. There's another same ring to it, though. Hey, tired. I have a divisive question. Oh dear. Please don't make me say that. This is going on. This is on Twitch right now, and it's going to go on YouTube later. I know. Um. Oh no. So, question. Uh, gameplay wise, un uninvolving story. Gameplay wise, what do you think is better, Destiny or Warframe? Uh, I don't know Warframe's story yet. I didn't say. I said leaving out the story. I'm talking oh. about just gameplay. I thought you said the complete opposite. Um, well, as I, I also don't really have much experience in, like, actually playing well at Warframe. Destiny, I can say I can play at a medium skill level. Like, medium approaching high skill level. Warframe, I am a absolute fucking noob and a gremlin, and I just run around on the free roam worlds all day and I like, catch fish. That's all I do. Uh, Wait, you can catch fish? Yes, you can fish in Warframe. You can, uh... <clears throat> okay, I gotta reinstall the game. <laughs> uh, be Wait, a minute. Oh my god, they actually did it. I'm actually, actually excited. Mm. I'm excited, happy. Every, every time you mori someone in Death of Daylight now, the entire UI will disappear, so the, uh, so the mori looks more cinematic. Oh, neat. Bush. I need uh, leaves. When did an AI plug in? When did an AI plug in the chat into the VC? Uh, Belladonna berries. Where the fuck? Okay, Belladonna, Mugwort, Yellow Dock, Mandrake. Belladonna, Mugwort, Yellow Dock. Wait. Belladonna, Yellow Dock. Mugwort, Mandrake. Okay, so those are the only four plants. Okay. Is there a brown dock? No? Ignore, ignore the confused, tired noises. Just please ignore them for the love of God. Um... I am just stupid. Getting, I, I tried to tune into the stream so that I could see what you were up to, but I'm getting the guy code lizard in my face. <laughs> Get fucked. Ah, nerd, you didn't subscribe to the hit streamer, Tired Arts? No, because I refused to give Twitch a single cent. Fair enough. I only do like, I only do because I have free Twitch Prime. I yeah. refuse to give I refuse to give Twitch even a cent, especially after they change the rates at which streamers get paid through subscriptions. It's just not happening now. Fair enough. If I have money, I'm, you know, enough money to buy a subscription, I'm not buying a sub. I'm gonna, you know, either spend it on games and, you know, waste my life away and die as a skeleton in a seat. Or just send it through, like, Patreon or Ko-Fi. Yeah, I'd probably get more out of that. <laughs> yeah. No, you just factually would. They have better rates. I, that just reminds me, I have not checked on Ko-Fi because I've never bothered checking. I it's don't it's basically a tip jar. Yeah, no, I have a Ko-Fi. It's on my Twitch at all times. Mm. I have a Ko-Fi as well. It's just, I here, here's the wacky thing, right? I have one. I've had one for a minute, uh, but I've not used it because I can't set it up because I don't have the proper things to make it work. Because apparently uh, PayPal doesn't enough. like me. I'm not old enough. No, it's just PayPal doesn't like me. I don't think PayPal likes anyone. No, no, it doesn't. Yo, I am supposed to, like, make a payment, but Tired, I Tired, press space. But I, I was pressing if space, you, fuck you. If you, no, if you press space, okay. If you press space uh, while you're floating with a grappling hook, mm -hmm. uh, you'll launch yourself, like, really high. That's what I do whenever I'm swinging. It's a really useful uh, momentum tool. I'm also not immune to fall damage yet. 
Penelope, are you mad? Harry took your spot. <laughs> oh, did the oh. cat switch spot? Uh, Harry took the basket spot, and so she's mad. <laughs> L. L, indeed. Fucking I know a, skill issue. I, I know a game I should, I should stream. Eh. Garfield Kart. What? <laughs> I'd be careful with streaming, like, I, I'd be real careful playing old games, right, from, like, 2013. Just Why? in general. Okay, wacky story time, right? Uh-oh. So, I like Black Ops 1. I like Black Ops 1 a lot. Uh, so, I was streaming it at one point with some, you know, some friends, right? Uh, because I like Black Ops 1. <laughs> Uh, and a wacky thing happened where I looked at the bottom right of my screen and saw this wacky string of numbers. What? Saw this wacky string of numbers, and I recognized that wacky, st that wacky string of numbers as my IP address. <laughs> what? <laughs> or at least one that was very close to me. Uh, and immediately was like, uh-oh. Uh -oh. And had uh, basically turned off my stream almost immediately and deleted the VOD <laughs> and had my friend do the exact same and warned them. Uh, I cannot stream Black Ops 1 anymore without being extremely careful. Not like I'm going to be streaming it anyways because no one I know has the game. Okay, okay. What caused it to do that? Uh, zombies multiplayer. Specifically. Uh... But there's nothing on it happening. There's no information that that happens, and there's no information on how to stop that from happening. Uh-oh. Like, there's nothing. Like, it doesn't happen for anyone. It's just, oh, yeah, that's just a you problem, mate. It's like, what? Like, game just says fuck you in specifics. Yes. The worst part is, it's not even, like, a thing that happens consistently. Oh, so it's like a abnormal issue? Yes, and I don't know what the, like, pretense of it happening is, and I'm too lazy to, like, experiment <laughs> enough to figure out what causes it, because it takes, like, eight hours to get into a single match. Hmm. Do we have to buy Black Ops 1 because you're going to some zombies? What? Do, we have to buy, do you want me to buy Black Ops 1 because you're going to some zombies? It's... Maybe? I don't know. It's like yeah. 50 bucks. Still. I, I'll just wait for a discount. It doesn't exist, trust me. The last time I got a discount on the game was two years ago. Whenever the entire franchise was on sale. And even then it was only like a discount of like two dollars. This day two servers are not available. I'm going to actively piss them Hold off. on one second. Let me go. Let me go check Charlemagne. Charlemagne's a bot that's set up in the rat server that shows the status of D2 servers. Um. Your, your Destiny 2 is temporarily being brought offline to assist in investigations into error codes, inability to log in, and login queues. More information will be provided once available. That was tweeted at 921. It is currently, uh. 1008. Okay. Uh, as a Warframe vet that just began investing in Destiny 2, the biggest difference that makes that still makes Warframe more enjoyable is, number one, the long-winded satisfaction and level of ability customization. 42 Warframes versus... You, uh, and your gear isn't locked to one or the other. Huh. Yeah, no, I, I think... So, MMOs, right, just in general, I, I, I have a general, like, just tend to want to play MMOs and experiment with them because MMOs are have a very MMORPGs have a very specific style, right? So I, I I've kind of dipped my toes in a couple of them. I dipped my toes in RuneScape, Maple Story, uh, Black Desert, and Final Fantasy. Uh, <clears throat> I tried V two. V two does not feel like an MMO. <laughs> And does something that I hate in every MMO, which is, like, uh, what is it called? Uh, uh, like, class locking shit. I hate class locking. Like, I don't the know. The only 
The only really class lock shit in D2 uh, is the armor. Yeah, but I like my drip tired. Fair enough. Yeah. Okay, that's where the uh, the destiny thing of fashion is the end game comes from. Hmm. I'm so bored. I'm. I mean, green, that, so it's another thing. Cubing. There's another thing about it, right? Fashion is the end game. Like compared to my experience in FF14, right? Mm -hmm. Fashion was like the beginning. <laughs> like it was only until like I got comfortably into the mid game that I really started specking into it. But I still had a lot of really good cosmetics by that point and could easily like do a singular raid and have enough money to go to like the auction house and buy half like an entire set of gear that was just like really nice huh. hilariously uh -huh. enough i built a gan like one of the best things right that i that i did was build a gambling game and then play it so much to the point where i was able to get enough money from all of my friends to buy a jacket cosmetic Okay, uh, reason number two why Ben likes Warframe more. Level of monetization, gatekeeping, content. Probably put 120 bucks since 2014 into Warframe. Felt very satisfied with it. Two chapters of D2 is around half of that. With Lightfall being $60. Um, mm. And I'm pretty sure Witch Queen is around 40 And you can get about... If you play the campaign like a casual shitter, like I did, uh, about six hours, not counting oh. seasonal content. <laughs> okay. But that's no, for a whole year of, like, actually, I don't know if that's actually the uh, season pass bundle. I don't know. I might be wrong. Is so, that... six hours of general gameplay mm -hmm. for $60. I hate to make comparisons, but, like... Sixty dollars, even I think I think it's fifty dollars. Fifty to sixty dollars can get you RDR two, and I have played that game for over three hundred hours, and I'm like I haven't even completed the story yet. Yeah, I will admit that Destiny is a very unhealthy addiction. Sorry, do you need to go through rehab? I really do. I really Why? fucking do. Why did you tweet? Why did you tweet? Why did you tweet that? Ah. What? Why am hey, I in the middle of the fucking woods? A comp a uh, a certain game company that or a certain brand certain game I follow on Twitter posted something called Getting Close. And I I'm pretty sure where, everyone else been. Uh, talk about talk about CSGO. CSGO tweeted getting close, so Source 2 is coming out and I'm actually quite excited. What no? Yeah, Sora 2 is actually coming up, Sora. It's been two years. They're finally putting it out? Yeah, the beta is, is happening this month. Whoa. Cringe. <laughs> I give Gary Newman the tools any day of the week, but give it to the actual, like, general populace. Oh, no, you're going to have to wait two years for that one, laddie. My goal is to get a thousand hours in CSGO. My goal is to get a life. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, Alrighty. Uh, okay. Current. I'm, I'm lost in the woods. I don't know where I am. All right. What? I don't know where I am. Is it, isn't Red Dead the same game where you can, like, in the forest, you can stumble across a certain kind of thing? I'm not going to go in detail. I literally have no idea what you're talking about, Chief. Ghost like sacrifice rings, of... bears. No, uh, the hooded white figures. Oh, yeah. <laughs> then oh. again, they're not that much of a threat. I'm going to be Actually, real. The biggest threat in the entire game world is you. That's Red Dead 2, right? Was it Red Dead 1? Uh, that's Red Dead 2. Mm. Those are boars. You're bored. Dumbass. <laughs> <laughs> mm -hmm. 
I'm just, I'm not even like on a horse. I'm just walking through the woods. I'm a menace. Can I, can I, can I like, oh, uh, put 50 in for Beyond and Witch Queen, Queen on sale to match my money to gameplay ratio to Warframe. I have to get around 500 hours. <laughs> Which DLC? No, no, no. I know people that have 500 hours total playtime in the game, and they've bought in all the DLCs. Yeah, no, not <laughs> no. I mean, shame. Like recently, like in the past two weeks, I dumped 120 hours in the D2. Yeah, but. That's shame. He has no life. I, I, okay. Those doesn't all have to be enjoyment hours, but just 1,000 hours I'm willing to spend. Well, yeah, no. As I said, D2 is a very unhealthy addiction that I probably should just kick at this point. Like, it, it's fun, but, like, it is not sustainable. Alright, if you want, I'll try and help you go through rehab. <laughs> By the way, north or south? What? North or south? North. North. Okay. If I get hit by a train, I blame you. <laughs> oh, I'm actually, I'm gonna actually I'm north, north. Okay. Uh, right or left? Right, because I'm right-handed. Okay. Um, hold on. Can you guys? Uh, okay, I will be right back. I'm feeling slightly nauseous. Can you two cover for me while oh, I'm gone? Absolutely. Yeah. Absolutely. All right. Uh, Sarah, let's, let's, let's bully. No. No. I will be right back. You two take care of stream. Okay. Make sure no one says anything offensive in chat. Chat, make sure they don't say anything offensive. I won't. I like kicking children. That's just normal you. Yay! That's not offensive. That's just just right. Just morally correct. I like the I like the drop kick probably the same Jeffrey Bezos. Huh. Okay, but unrelated to Destiny and Warframe. All right, <clears throat> there is a third wild game that I was originally addicted to and learned to drop because it was. One, an unhealthy addiction, and two, just not worth it to play long term. You mother buffer. Um, it's a wild, wacky game called Red Dead Online. <laughs> Dude, some person, I don't know how many hours, dumped so many hours into, I think, Google Stadia version of that, where... Rockstar actually sent that sent the dude stuff. You know what I'm talking about? Uh, maybe. Uh, hold on. Makes sense if you're already shilling to Sony or Microsoft and getting put on Game Pass, but otherwise, now nah, fam, without my best friend investing in it. I honestly, I I get that a lot. I like there have been a couple of times where like I've dropped out of MMOs, but like a friend started playing it. I was like, mm, well, maybe I should pop back in. Maybe I should just give it a chance. Oh my God, you mother of a <laughs> Anyways, yeah, no, like just maybe I'll give it another chance and come back, right? Uh, but then I just like, no, no, this isn't not good. This isn't good for me. I need to stop. That or just like I, I, I gain into it, chief. Oh, I have a daily challenge. Yeah, so I have a question that I know you're probably going to be giving a shit post to answer. Uh, I, I want, okay, I want to stream, like, a horror game. Like, sometime soon, not, like, today, but do you know any good horror games? Five Nights at Freddy's. No. Well, yeah, my answer. But do you actually not like Tattletale? No. Wait, how high of a level am I? Hold on. Where's my... 
Nope, that's my catalog. Put it away. Put it away. God damn it. L? There it is. Oh, I'm level 34. I thought I was 304. So, what do you think of the game Among Us Sleep? Uh, I think it's old YouTube content. <laughs> what is Slender the Arrival? That's, that's not a good fucking Die. game to play. Let me look at Okay. Or. Here's one game I played and actively quit. Just go in the play of Rift game. by the people who made Trove. Gives you that MMO fix for free, but it's bland enough. To just drop and pick up sporadically. I tried Trove for a while, thinking it would be, you know, all cool and poggers. Because, like, the YouTuber or two that I watched consistently uh, played it. <laughs> I was wrong. I was just wrong. <laughs> Who's screaming? What's going on over there? A gunshot. I would walk 500 miles and I would walk 500 miles. What is Pizza Tower? You should buy Pizza Tower. Don't play why it. Don't stream it... horror games. Buy Pizza why Tower. Is, why is Pizza Tower classified as horror? I don't know. But why is my scary monsters but... classified as horror? Design. Oh, yes. Yeah, so I'm going to put $20 into Bigfoot. Hello, Angus. Civilization. I've made it. Oh, no, don't you get shows. mad at me for saying about, about uh about, uh, Bigfoot. Uh. I don't know. Who are you? Wait, isn't that in, like, Red Dead 1 or 2 that you can actually buy, uh, like, a Sasquatch? Or is my thing a different game? So I I'm thinking about either Red Dead 1 or 2 or GTA. I don't remember. You're thinking of both GTA and RDR 1. It first showed up in RDR1 in Undead Nightmare, and then showed up again in GTA 5. I only know that I'm fact gonna... about... I only know the Undead Nightmare fact because my, my family did something really cool back whenever I played it consistently. So, whenever I got Undead Nightmare, uh... I had both Undead Nightmare and the base game. Right. After I got Undead Nightmare, my specifically my dad thought it was a wondrous, awesome pog champ idea, real big shot move to take back my base game copy of RDR to GameStop without telling me. Uh, I had literally beaten the entire game and wanted to rerun through it at that point. I was very, very upset. Because uh, Red Dead Redemption was, at my at the time, my favorite game. Like, it was a wee bit devastating. <laughs> We well, hear a funny trade I did once at a game store. So there's this one shop in my state where it's like, hey, trade a game and get another. You know what game I traded? What? Fucking Angry Birds for COD World at War. World at War was the first game that actually gave me nightmares. Because I, because I actually played the uh, the campaign entirety. The sniper. Mm -hmm. The sniper mission actually really made me mad, but when I first unlocked uh, Nazi zombies, that that mode gave me nightmares. What game for the first time in Sora gave you like 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 terrified you or like, scared you? Uh... Ignoring that last. Hmm. 
just in general or yeah, in general, in... Like any game. No, I mean like of recent years or Either just of recent or your first. Uh I I don't really know. I don't really play a lot of horror games. Uh closest I can probably say is Minecraft mainly because of an addiction to like no, no, no! It was Slender the Eight Pages. Slender the Eight Pages and Minecraft Hero Brian. Oh my God! Yeah, no, you actually reminded me. My the first thing then was not Roulette War that scared me. It was Slender the Arrival demo for the 360. It was late at night. It was me, my sister, and her friend who were watching me play the game. That game was terrifying. Bonk. Boo. Hi. I saw you were back. You can't fool me. I know. I was supposed to be trying to get out. Alright. Uh, so, what was discussed while I was gone? So, uh, it's the question I actually uh, I want to ask you. Hmm? Is there any, like, what, what was the first game that I gave you nightmares, or just completely scared you? Gave me nightmares? Uh... Like, game that just, like, terrified you. Well, I wasn't really allowed to play scary games as a kid, right? But, due to my lack of exposure, uh, a lot of things that normally probably wouldn't freak people out, I had no context for. And, therefore, freaked me out a lot. Uh, just... I always had I've always had issues with underwater caves. Um I've also always had issues with very wide empty outdoor places cuz I always think something should be here and it isn't. Well, there's no way in hell there's nothing here. No, that's that's actually that is uh, I believe it's it's whatever the opposite of claustrophobia is, I believe. That is. I feel like I'm wrong. It's not thalassophobia. No, thalassophobia is the fear of water. Or feel it. Fear of the ocean. Uh, I'm not afraid really? of the ocean, because I grew up right next to it. But I am afraid of being, like, trapped underwater. Because I know just how bad drowning is. There's a game I feel like that would terrify you that I feel like you should stay away from. Subnautica. Iron Lung. See, the thing is, that is... I've seen gameplay of that, and that doesn't really fit. Iron Lung is very well lit. You know what's going to happen. It's obvious throughout the entire game that you're just going to fucking die. The only surprise yes. is the way it happens. It's a great claustrophobic, and it's like it's real, like the ocean's like fairly unknown in the game. Isn't like you're actually alone, but it gives you the illusion of you are not alone. Uh, you're. I believe uh, human wise, you are alone, but like creature wise, no, no, there's there's shit everywhere. Um. Uh, horror options. You're actually claustrophobic, lost in vivo. Want not SCP FNAF? I'm on observation duty. Just the weird shit? Search Kitty Horror Show HIO in Google. Oh, and more existential horror off. I've, I've heard of observation duty. I've seen observation duty. Not much to write home to, back home to. Hmm. A game that, uh, for some reason, otherwise scared me, even though it shouldn't have, that made me actually end stream, was Summer 58. It's not even that scary, but it scared me for some reason. I got a really good uh, existential horror game for you. You go play this game called Plug and Play. No! What? No! Sora, so, no! Okay, okay, you want you want some explanation? Sure. So Plug and Play is this wacky little game. Uh, made by a developer who I think did like magic mushrooms while he was coding <laughs> it and making it because it is an actual like drug trip. Hmm. Let me 
I need to eat some some fucking beans. Okay, I I need elaboration. Space boy. Uh, so like it is like I don't really know how to explain it any more than that. Like the developer was just stoned while he was making it. It's the only way I can explain it. Hmm. Dude was high as hell. It it's it's like hella existential. It's not right. horror. It just it's a lie. It's just weird as shit. Like we're we're talking, like there's a bit where a dude literally sh like, uh, you know the metal part of like a plug, right? Like a uh, power cord, like the uh, the little little the prong to the power cord. Mm -hmm. There's a bit in the game where like a dude with a a socket for a head shits two of those out and you put it in his head and he turns into a plug and then he plugs himself into someone's ass. <laughs> and that's just how that's just how the game is played. Like, it's just, it's just like whole, that. Yeah. No, that's just like the whole game. It's just an experience. It's what happens whenever you get a, is give someone Unity 2 and, you know, force feed them magic mushrooms for three hours. <laughs> I see. I hate this conversation stemming that I do want to try. I want to reattempt that whole thing Unreal and actually try developing something. The thing is, I, I'm going to have to watch it towards like Hedy's modular pieces. And an answer to Mr. Nobody's question. Oh, wait, hold on. In working memory, yeah. Golden Light is the only game I've stopped playing due to bro. I'm too weird of that right now to keep going. Oh my god. Wait, I think Golden Light's actually a game on my wish list. I think. Mm -hmm. Hold on, let me check. I, as I said, I don't really know many horror games because I wasn't even allowed to play them. Yeah, Golden Light's um, my place. I saw it on Game Show. I'm like, oh, this game looks sick. So I put it in my wish list. I Actually, neither was I really. Uh, the only exposure to horror games I really had was Slender, uh, Among the Sleep, and I want to say the Stanley Parable because somewhere in there that classifies as a horror game. Existential horror. Yeah, somewhere there, at least for a few of the endings, definitely. Uh. But it is it is a it is a very odd thing. Like I, I wasn't really allowed to get any horror games. I think my first real horror game that I got uh, mm -hmm. that I can really remember was Alien Isolation. I think that was the first real horror game I got. Dunk. How bitch, how dare you still live? Get out of here. I've been wandering these train tracks for a minute. I ain't seen no signs of nothing. Hmm. I'm starting to get a little worried here. Five hundred miles an hour would walk five hundred more. With me and a man who walked a thousand miles. Da 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 da. Da 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 da. This game is still hella gorgeous. For real. Also, oh, I but, want to apologize again way, for being quiet. No, 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 you're good. You're good. You want to eat your axe? Throw. <laughs> and throw, fing <laughs> throw fingers all to try and reach the end. Of a gut and save your girlfriend. <laughs> Real shit. What? I don't know. Oh, was that about the uh the one game you quit because it was so fucking weird? I don't know. I talking Ben about that. Hmm. Uh... <laughs> By the way, if I start screaming and, you know, I, I don't know what I'll be saying generally, but just generally screaming, mm -hmm. uh, just assume that a train is, you know, actively chugging towards me. 
and I have no way to go but literally just continue to run down the track in the hmm. opposite direction. There's only one train on the map, so it's unlikely that I'll like I'll ever see it walking through here. But there is in the <laughs> the chance is low, but never zero. <laughs> <laughs> Plus, it's kind of hard to discern whether or not what I'm hearing is waterfalls in the distance, or... Chug, 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 Prepare to die. Thomas had never seen such bullshit before. <laughs> mm -hmm. Oh, I just ran across a player camp next to the tracks. Do you think there are a bunch of people who rob? Or no. thieves? I don't That's the their, word. They don't, they don't have their white flag up, so they're what? not friendly. But I guess people who rob. Tired of the word is thieves. Crips, is that you? What? Yeah, it's just Crips. No, I just saw a person. I wondered if it was the, the camp guy or if it was uh, a player. It's just a camp guy. Hmm. He's just vibing. Wait, do they have a dog? I wonder if they have a dog. They have a dog! Yo, doggo! Hello, Labrador, Labrador Retriever. What's up, my brother? Pat, pet, pet, pot, pot, pet, pot. What? Oh boy. Oh, like we were petting. trying to pet, and the game wasn't allowing you. No, that was just my petting sounds. Ah. Pet, pet, pot, pet, pot. Have y'all ever seen the bridge? What? Okay, I'll take that as a no. The bridge but... from RDR, or like a movie called The Bridge? The bridge from RDR. Uh-oh. So... There's a bridge out in the game world, specifically in, it's a little, like, rope suspension, like, it's a, it's one of those, like, you know, wooden rickety bridges, right? Oh, yeah. Like, a wooden rickety rope bridge, right? Mm-hmm. And it's in the game world that is a part of the RDR1 game world, because the thing about the RDR2 map is that it's, you know, the new areas, but it's literally grafted onto the old map. Hmm. But in you know an enhanced version since an enhanced but earlier version of the world since it's a prequel to RDR one. Hmm. Anyways, um, there's a bridge in a gorge in the RDR one portion of the map that if you throw a tomahawk or throwing knife into a very specific spot, it freaks the fuck out. <laughs> And starts, like, spazzing out. And if you walk on it, you can actually get sent to Mexico. <laughs> like, literally? Or uh, Yes. Uh, you can also fly halfway across the map. <laughs> is that, like, a speedrunning strat? <laughs> this is, no, because not, it's not a speedrunning strat because uh, you rarely ever go to that portion of the map in the story. Um... But in online, it's just a very fun and efficient way to travel, though, <laughs> albeit with quite deadly consequences. Oh, yeah, because you can't be immune to fall damage. Yeah. Holy crap. Hmm? Look at that. Hold on, I'm not tapped in because I'm actually playing Minecraft. Yeah, still. I know, I know. Oh, why did you say look at that? Pixel's deafened. I don't know. <laughs> just oh it's gorgeous it's a rainbow oh natural gay natural gay Woo oh my god i love it so much I would walk 500 miles and I would walk 500 more with a little man who walked a thousand miles to the 
Ooh, finally a PlayStation. Yeah, but if I go spot the train, I'm gonna have to get back on it. Also, what? Uh, going back to the whole horror game question thing, you're probably gonna punch me in the face and call me cringe for this. But I the earliest horror game that I can remember playing was back in middle school when uh, friends and I would sit behind the piano in the orchestra room and pass around a Kindle with FNAF 2 on it. FNAF 2. No. That might have been my first cause... horror game. Might have. I would have said it would also have been mine because I had FNAF 2 on my, on my phone. Mm -hmm. But I had played... A I, like, I had sailed the seven seas and played a little bit of alien isolation <laughs> oh yes sailed the seven seas cause... i don't think twitch likes me talking about it that's fair why enough. i'm i'm using that fair but... enough fair enough fair enough not pissed can i please just click uh -oh. on what uh oh i see a player just pray they're friendly That's yeah, all you really can yep. do. And they just passed me. Hmm. They don't give a shit. Maybe they're there for the train. No, nope, they just actually crossed the bridge or the intersection between rails and road. They just hmm. slide in. How often do you see people that just murder? Uh, actually, not as much as you'd think. Hmm. Uh, only a few times. The only time I actually see anyone be outrightly, like, outright malicious is when I'm in Blackwater or they're a, a hacker. And even then, most of the time, the hackers are better than the actual developers of the game. So. <laughs> Wait, they, like, act better? Or? Yeah. Wait, what do the devs do then? Nothing. Oh. They at least exist and make the game more fun for players from time to time. That's the difference. Hmm. Is that a horse? I can't tell if that's a horse or a bear. Hold on, let me point a gun at it. No, nope, that's a bear. Okay. D what? Bear. I think the player's back, maybe. Maybe. Uh oh, long tunnel. So the gamble of GTA hackers. <laughs> uh actually GTA five has a like it, it is actually hilarious. Uh no. GTA hackers actually have a bigger ratio to just be dickheads, as well as the just general player base. Red Dead 2's player base is just a bunch of howdy. <laughs> just a bunch of howdy. <laughs> How you doing? Uh, they're actually some really friendly dudes. Also, uh, the train tracks have gone into a massive, like, uh, tunnel. Is that a horse? No, that's a Rocky Mountain bull elk on the tracks inside the tunnel. <laughs> what? <laughs> Oi. What are you doing? Get out of here. You're going to get hit by a train. Or I will. I don't know. Well, it depends where it comes from. Who it hits first. Just like, oh, I hear the train. Just turns around slowly. Uh oh. <laughs> Realization slowly dawns. Are there dwellers in the general vicinity? No, just elk. Oh. Lots of elk. Sorry, we didn't leave you any. You can try and take you can try and take a gamble of you know punching the elk and seeing what happens, but nine times out of nine times out of ten, they're probably just gonna remove your eyes. You're going to do the Adventure Time thing where it's going to get up on its hind legs and take off its fucking hooves and reveal just... it's got hands. I love what Dragon Trainer, uh, what Dragon Trainer put in their, in their server, Sora. 
press cat to cat. Man, this okay. I I called out to the the, the elk in the tunnel, right, and it just <laughs> legitimately locked eyes with me for a minute. It was like, oh. It's last thing game. you last thing you want to see in a dark tunnel. As you said earlier, it's sore. It's all fun games until the elk's sitting on their legs. Just want to get out of the tunnel. I don't think that applies. It totally does. Does that apply? I don't know enough. Mm. I, I don't know enough. Wildlife photographer. World event. Huh. Hmm. Can I buy a child? Okay. Let's move along. Be oh, one of my oh. daily challenges. Walk a thousand miles. Oh. Is that why you were singing that, Sora? Yeah, no. Why do you think I was walking down the drain tracks? Uh, because I train? Walk, oh, I needed to travel a certain amount of distance. I thought you just like trains, like that too. Honestly, or, I was lucky that I even found the train track. I'm I'm intentionally not using my map right now because I don't want to. I like I trains. Think I think it's more. <laughs> I think it's more fun to just you know wander the world without a map. Is is it even possible to use a forty ninety and actually have it work? What, graphics 40, card? Yeah. No. Maybe. Is that a bear? Hold on. That is a bear. Huh. Correction, was a bear. So... You hear, you hear an elephant rifle <laughs> ring out in the distance? Was so, a bear. So CSGO put me into uh, a casual match of full, but they put me as a spectator. Let's see. Hey, Google. Right. What's the question? Give me skin the grizzly bear. Dun 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 dun. Yoink! Your skin is mine. Goodbye. Right for a split moment, I thought you were playing on um, cocaine. So no. Just... I'm just vibing in heresy. I, I named the stream title Pack of Heresy version 2. Me, 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 me. I can't read. I'm dyslexic. Neat. Sorry. Okay. Actually, one of the things that I've seen a couple of players do, right? Mm -hmm. Like, there, there are these, like, really good fucking Samaritans in the game that'll just travel the world, right? Mm -hmm. And just give players parts of the daily challenges that day. Hmm. Huh. So, like, you know, oh, alligator skin or whatever, right? Here. <laughs> Take it. Have fun. Uh, another thing Another thing I've seen is community fishing events. <laughs> Which we have fishing with Destiny 2, so we have something where you can AFK to. I mean, you can AFK in, like, uh, in orbit and just listen to the music. Uh, I have lost. I have lost the bear pelt in a uh, tragic climbing accident. A tragic climbing accident that involved the deletion of an entire bear pelt into the nobody realm. Hmm. I asked the nobody realm. I don't know. Uh, but literally, there were there was uh like congregations of like five players at a time just fishing in certain areas. Uh, because, like, there, like, in GTA, right, there's no reward for killing people, but, like, the game is populated by a bunch of shitters and, you know, kids, right? Mm-hmm. This game, it doesn't have that same appeal of, oh, cars, you know, guns, strippers, oh, yeah. Uh, <laughs> so you just get a bunch of, like, old dudes who just pop on for five minutes to, you know, enjoy their night, right? Mm-hmm. Or people who are just generally not there to do that. They're just there to exist. Right? Mm-hmm. 
So you just end up getting a bunch of like either stoners or old fathers who just don't have don't have like a bone in their body that can be anything other than well, howdy. That's neat. That's neat too. From from the reviews I've seen, it's just it's just a bunch of old people playing it. I swear, there's a, there's so many old people who play Destiny too. It's surprising. All right, are you old? I feel hey, it. Are you a boomer? Where my no. back is, I feel it. Tired is not a boomer. No, it's not. It's tired just confirmed that she's a boomer. They're not a boomer. Shut the fuck up. It's no more like there's a boomer in here. It smells like a check your ass, bud. Shadow, are you a boomer? I don't know what's going on hey. anymore. Shadow. Save me. Are you fat, Shadow? Who you fat? Who's a fat little cat man? <laughs> uh, it's probably to Mr. Nobody's question. Can I buy a chat? Oh, that's... That's Alice. She, she says stuff like that a lot. You just kind of learn to ignore it. I'm patting my stomach like your drums so you can get on me. I'm like, no, come here. Shut up. No. Come here. This also happens a lot. <laughs> Fist fight you, Shadow. Come here. Come here. I won't fist fight you if you get on my lap. Come here. Oh, good boy. Good Shout boy. out to that time I had enough cans of beans in this game to become overweight and then immediately lost all that weight by walking halfway across the map. <laughs> what? Actual thing I did. I intentionally <laughs> stopped using my horse for a while so that I could just run across the map and lose all of my character's weight that I had gained by eating thousands of cans of beans. <laughs> I learned to stop eating beans and start eating, like, hunted food, like venison and shit. Mm -hmm. Because it was unironically better for my character. And <laughs> two, I didn't have to run across the map so that I wasn't overweight anymore. <laughs> now I just do it because I find it fun. <laughs> like, unironically, it is actually more fun... For me at this point to just wander across the world like a wandering nomad who has no fucking idea where I am. I only have vague ideas where things are anymore. And honestly, I don't know why, just playing without a map in a game is just really fun. <laughs> huh? Either because it's, you know, idea of being lost and just exploring, right? coming across things organically or the thought that at any moment I could accidentally fall off the you know I oh, realized the entire a, time I think tired chat I've been they, uh dragon's been calling me Mr. Nobody I just realized I clarified earlier <laughs> like just like three minutes ago ish but yeah Ah, ow, my ribs, motherfucker! Ow, mother! I'm okay. I'm okay. I just my back is not happy with me, and I'm gonna have to handle that of physical therapy tomorrow. And there goes my right elbow. Uh oh. Hey, uh, turn okay. the Yeah, I'm okay. What's up? So this is like a question that I like, always plagues me. Does anyone like? In your house, actually, it's responsible. Actually, if a toilet's clogged, we'll actually unclog it because no one in my house will unclog the toilets. And it infuriates me. Does anyone in your house actually unclog? Like, well, it's multiple and not just one person. It infuriates Whoever's me. fault it is has to handle it. Yo! What's going on in here? You can probably clarify right as the stream cut out my end. I had to go back to audio only. Alright. Chewing tobacco. Yummy. Boop. Open sesame. 
Ah, uh, okay. Well, that's all this rickety old place has. I'm gonna gun a child. Can we please stop with the child violence? Like, the bit's gotten old here. Things I never thought I'd have to say. <laughs> Move on to something new, like, you know, drug trading or organ harvesting. Come on, get with the program. Would you rather, would you rather douse, a, douse an elder in gasoline? I, you just moved up in the age bracket. Nothing's changed. <laughs> I mean, like, at a certain point, both of them wear diapers, Chief. You've not really changed much. <laughs> Neither of them know where they are, either. Yeah. Would you rather, oh, would God, you is that a cougar? No, uh, no, 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 no. You know, that's a very dangerous thing to say after talking about old people. It's so wrong, though. Oh, Sora, how good oh. is van how yeah. does vanilla, uh, is vanilla, vanilla Zomboid? Uh, it's pretty good, I guess. You could certainly do a lot in it, it's just, like, I personally, yeah, it might, it's probably just me. I, I play games wrong. Mm -hmm. What do you mean wrong? I don't know a better way to explain it. Like, you mod them? I don't see that as wrong. I mod them to a point where I'm not even playing that game anymore. Also, I have a cougar pelt now. Congrats. And I skinned an old person alive. <laughs> No. <laughs> well, we're back to the old people. I, I know. Uh, I was going to make a joke about how a bit never dies, but uh. Built song never dies. Just in my little world. Built song never dies. Oh, the bomb went off. Okay, I'm curious. What? Me after Please Hiroshima go. happens. No! She is still tired. Oh, that's what I'm playing. Ah. Uh. Sorry. <laughs> let's, let's not make those jokes in the future. Please. Okay, I'm sorry. It's okay. You know better now. How many punches do it, does it take to an arm to get to the bone? What did it say? How many punches would it take to get to the bone of an arm? Um, punches? Yeah. Well, you'd basically have to pulverize the meat, so... How about someone's arm? A human, like, a live person's arm? Yeah, um, that depends on, like, your actual punching strength, where you're hitting... Uh, a bunch of different factors. Wait, yeah, arm. Still, like upper arm, lower arm. Alright, so I need to make this, which requires tallow or animal fat. And then I need this, which requires mangrove wood, which. Boy, good luck finding that. Um, I've got dual berettas. I can gun someone down. <gasps> hold on, hold on, hold on. I have found. The thing. Why are you making so many crafting tables? You'll see. The most broken item in this entire fucking mod pack. The uncrafting table. Yep. Please. I'll tell the town. 
Big boy. Fungi's hi I regret listening to my own clip. Runewood. Oak logs. Otherworld wood. Blood hi uh, Sorry. You're, you're okay. Oh. You're just grooving. I'm not going to judge you for grooving. I think Pixel just died. Huh? Hold on. Where'd she go? <laughs> oh, internet might have died. No, they made a sound. Yeah, it might have just been internet dying. I don't know. Maybe. Dark wood. <laughs> oh, mahogany. Oh, yeah. All right, and that is why this thing might be just a teensy bit broken. All right, and then I just need animal fat, which I can get from killing vanilla animals, usually. Problem is getting one of those chickens, maybe? Maybe chickens will drop it. If I could find a damn chicken. I'm as happy as a cloud. I'm going nowhere. I'm tired. I'm around. I'm in my place. I roll from town to town. And I'm myself. She falls off. So I just need uh, animal fat now. Plenty of leather. Just need to go find chickens because those are the only vanilla mobs that will actually spawn in the twilight, I believe. Because the boars don't drop it. Stags don't drop it. Rabbits don't drop it. Various birds don't drop it. Only chickens. Possibly. That's a possibly. Oh, I found a town. Oh, nice. Around the world. The water rips. There, the world of world. I roam around, 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 I, it took me a second to realize what was attacking me. Uh, that's what that delay was. <laughs> um, a chicken has been nearby. Hmm. Whoa. What? Lightning. <laughs> Can't see over all this tall grass. Don't like that.
Nothing. Hmm. Oh no, I don't think they have a butcher. I can't give them this pelt that I got. F. That sucks. Well, gonna do the next best thing. Y'all ain't got no butchers, so I'll be your new butcher. Bye bye. Who wants to fight? Oh, you're killing people. I mean, what else am I gonna do? You said you're gonna be the new butcher, so I thought you were gonna offer like to be one, not a murderer. Then well, again, you know what? Considering, never mind. I am the worst person to say that. No chat, I will not give you context. Actually, context might save me in court, but, um... <sighs> ah. Do these chickens just straight up not drop this shit? What are these, twilight chickens or some shit? The police force has not liked my antics. What do you mean? They're very angry with me. I see. Eh, eh. What the fuck? What the fuck was that? Is that a visual bug? Panic. What in the hell? Mm -hmm. Look, just shot him in the balls. What? Disabled. Whoop, there goes his skull. Okay, who are you killing? The police, apparently. Did you just randomly decide to snap? I wandered for so long tired, and they didn't have no butcher. I was intentionally slower because I was carrying a pelt. They tell me I ain't gotten they ain't got no butcher. That's where things change, my friend. Oh look, I'm not saying I'm not telling you anything, alright? That is entirely up to you to make poor decisions. Or have fun. It's, it's up to you. Um. Damn, I've already been going for almost four hours. What the fuck? Feels like it's been well, nothing since I lost track. Shot straight in the heart. Sucks to suck. You should have had a better trigger finger, pal. Ow! Talk shit, get hit. Oh, I'm in a coal mine. That explains a lot. Well, hmm. 
killed three bosses today. I killed the Twilich, I killed the Hydra and the Minus Shroom. I still have to kill the Phantom Knights, the Orogast, the Ice Queen, the Alpha Yeti. That's it. Fun. Oh, that's not good. Oh, and the final kobold. Yes, I'm actually counting that thing as a boss. Whoa. Hmm? Apparently I made the law very angry. Yeah, no shit, Sherlock. You went on the murder spree. Yeah, I was just being a little goofy. I'm just being a little silly. Yes, because that's what defines the... Right, well... I need to get to sleep because my... Everything hurts. Like I, my my vessel is in a lot of pain. Um, I'd like to thank y'all for tuning in. I will see you guys next episode whenever that happens to be. Um, probably not tomorrow because I have driving lessons and physical therapy tomorrow. So, yeah. Other than that, um, maybe Friday, possibly, but that might be a Destiny stream, that might be a Heresy stream, I don't know. Hell, maybe I'll even play Warframe and possibly get through a Fox Solaris. But, yeah, as I said, I will see y'all next time. Have a good night. Good night.